All right, guys, are you ready for some Resident Evil 2? I don't even know why I asked that, that question. It's rhetorical. Let's do this. Here we go. All right, all right, and let's do it. Hello everybody and welcome. Thank you all so much for joining me on this Saturday night, Sunday morning as we jump into the original Resident Evil 2, my favorite game of all time. Tonight we're playing the Seamless HD Project 2.0 and I'm super fun speedrunning. Yes, I'm going to be doing practice rounds, all right? There's something big going on right now and I can't talk about it, but let's just say that uh, a very big thing has happened and I cannot explain what has happened but i really do need to get good at this game and it's my favorite game of all time i i played this last not la not last friday or this last friday but the friday before and uh, i actually tried to go fast and i got an hour and 31 minutes and then the following day i was just kind of messing around on my computer and i was like you know what i want to play some resident Evil 2 i want to try it and i got an hour and 13 minutes and that was kind of trying um I, I, I don't know if it was just kind of practicing, getting the feel of it. I don't know if it was uh, nobody watching me, because you guys all stare at me while I'm trying to play and it makes me uncomfortable. Uh, but I got hour 13, so I'm going to try to shave a little bit off tonight. I have a feeling that I'm going to get maybe like an hour 20, hour 25, and I'm going to try to bring it down. I might be able to play this three times tonight, but I'm going to try to play it at least twice. Uh, so thank you all so much for coming by. This is a bonus stream. Uh, usually I use Saturdays to hang out with the kids and my wife, but they all went to bed. So I'm up, you know, I'm, I'm a night person. So welcome all my fellow night people. Thank you for coming by. And, uh, you know, every time we play Resident Evil 2, I just have so much fun. Like I've said so many times before that I could literally just have a channel dedicated to Resident Evil 2 and I'd be fine. I, I don't, I, I'd, I'd be completely fine with the mods that are out with the, you know, the seamless HD project. It's gorgeous. It's, it's literally like preserving this masterpiece of a game and I could just play it over and over I don't get bored with it people always ask me like don't you get sick of playing the same old games no I don't <laughs> not Resident Evil 2 uh, so thank you guys for coming by I got over a hundred people here that is awesome this is not my normal stream day so I appreciate that uh, going forward you can expect to see more of these just Resident Evil 2 me practicing you're gonna see more practices I feel like I'm Rocky and I'm running up the staircase, but instead I got my controller in hand, and I'm trying to get good at speedrunning because it's not something I've ever done before. And I don't think I'm gonna I'm gonna hit world records. I don't. I'm, I'm never say never. All right. If I really put my mind to it and I try, I guarantee you I could do well. But I'm I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. And tonight it's just more about learning, practicing, and hanging out with all of you. So you know I could play this on my own. Honestly, and it was fine, but it's not as fun as hanging out with everybody. So I really hope you guys enjoy this bonus. I hope you want to see more of these because regardless, I'm probably going to do them. Uh, so if you do enjoy this, hit that like button. Let's try to hit 250 tonight. If we do, I'll gift out a mercenary membership. And um, yeah, I, I mean, the, the likes also help the channel a ton. I mean, this isn't the Residence of Evil. This is my personal gaming channel. So uh, it's nowhere near on the same level of Residence of Evil. But I guarantee you, if you like the content there, you're probably going to like it here. So, thank you all for coming by. Let's catch up with the chat. I do a five minute starting soon here. 10 to 15 minutes just chatting. Let's just catch up and hang out. And then we jump into the gameplay. So, if you're watching the replay, don't worry. I'll have timestamps linked down below so you can jump to whichever portion of the stream you would like. And I'm going to weed out. I'm going to weed out. You know, over the, over the over the course of the next few months, I'm going to weed out who is the true Resident Evil 2 fans and who is just here. I, I, regardless, it's okay that you guys are here. But I know for some people, they'll be like, oh man, you're playing it again. Yeah. Yeah, I am. And I'm going to be doing it a lot more. It's a bonus, though. It doesn't take place of the normal stream. I got uh, actually got my stream planned out for JJ vs. Evil next Friday. It's going to be Rotten Flesh, a cosmic survival horror game, which looks super cool. Uh, so you're always going to get new games, but you're just going to get a little bonus of the GOAT, baby. Play the extra mode, JJ. Hold on. I got to practice the mode that I, I need to practice. Aw, thank you. No, thank you. YouTube just loves randomly buffering. I hate it. That's weird. That's weird that it does that. Son of a bitch. I made the 69. Hell yeah, brother. Thank you for hitting that like button. I appreciate it. Almost 100 likes already, too, which is crazy. Uh, thank you, guys. Thank you. Uh, hey, Jables. Jables is here. Texas is here. Hell yeah. Gift me the mercenary. Don't have to, but would love it. Thanks for all the content, brother. Hey, thank you, man. I appreciate that. And if I do gift out a membership, I know there's a lot of you that might want one, but Samuel, I hope you get it, man. 
Uh, hey, JJ and everyone, I like the new graphic that you are using. Thank you. You like this new overlay? Cool, because it's sticking around. I, I like it a lot, too. I'm happy with the way it turned out, and I'm glad you guys like it. Um, yeah, look at it. See, it updates in real time. That's cool. That's cool. Uh, RE2 was my gamer origin story. Man, this is the game that got me into the Resident Evil series. It's basically made who I am today. Like, honestly, the reason why the Residents of Evil exist is because of this game. Uh, I'm obsessed with this series because of this game. We got my buddy, my bro, Brandon Salisbury in the chat. How's it going, Brandon? Thank you for coming by. Ooh, a mercenary. What level is that? It's actually, it's Rose Squad, but it's the subsidiary team. It's like the side team. We don't talk about it unless you come on this channel, but it's the real MVPs, all right? We do all the heavy lifting. We do the dirty work. The Rose Squad doesn't want to, all right? Recruit, Bravo, Alpha, great. Appreciate you all, but the mercenaries is where it's at, brother. Thank you for coming by. I hope you're doing well. My birthday will be on your live stream next week. Hell yeah. Happy early birthday, Michael Pena. Uh, like, yeah, I hope you have a fantastic day, and hopefully we'll see you at the stream. We'll get them. We'll get those cakes in the chat for you, brother. Good early morning, everyone. Hell yeah. Uh, either it's super early for you guys or it's really late. Uh, either way, I'm, 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 that's kind of my audience here. I'm a, I'm a night person, so this is normal for me. I am on my way to the gym. We all know... Uh, that we need a muscle for boulder punching. Yeah, go get it. Go, go get swole, dude. Hell yeah. And punch those boulders, all right? Yo, what's going on, Solid Fire? Proxy One Creations. How's it going, Prox? Umbrella Court is better than Resident Evil 2. Prox, get your ass out of here. What the? God, God damn it. Comes in here with that. Nah, I'm, I appreciate you, Proxy, but you really do need to chickity check yourself. Hey, what's going on? Uh, my day was great. Uh, my daughter had her basketball tournament today. They did, they did good. They did good. I'm proud of them. Um, actually, the entire team is upstairs in her room right now sleeping. <laughs> they all came over here, and it was like chaos earlier. Uh, but no, they um, they made their way through, I think they won two games, lost the third game. They came back, won another two games, and then lost that game. So they got third place in their bracket, which is it's pretty solid. But I told them all, I was like, the reason why you're all here is because we need to talk about that game. And never let that happen again. And then my wife looked at me, and I was like, gold are bust <laughs> and they all understood uh 108 in the morning over here hell yeah uh i have the saturn version but we haven't played it yet oh you got the saturn version of resident evil 1 dude we almost played it in the yeah we did play it in the after party last uh god i'm getting my days last sunday on the residence of evil we played the saturn version of resident evil 1 tried it for the first time we're not going to play too much because i want to play the actual saturn version but we just tried you know the intro and man it's it's same same but different same but different. It's cool. I, I want to play it. So, Brandon, at some point, you and I, we're going to play Resident Evil 1 on the Sega Saturn. Damali is a baller. Yeah, she did good. Oh, man. She's 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 paying attention more. She's she's becoming more aggressive, which she definitely needs. And, um, no, she's doing a good job. I'm, I'm proud of her. Uh, she actually was, you know, trying. Uh, she always tries, but she was she's making some progress. So, uh, yeah, she did a great job. They all did. Vicious Night Owl. Uh, if you're... Uh, not first, you are last. Ricky Bobby, goddamn right, goddamn right. Words to live by. That's why I gotta practice speed running. Mm. I got some support in the chat. I appreciate that. I'm gonna read that, and then we're gonna jump to the game. So thank you all for coming by. Let's see what we got here. We got who do we got? We got Justin. Holy crap! Kicking this off with five gifted mercenary memberships. Hell yeah, dude! Thank you so much for growing the mercs, the real MVPs. Please, everybody, get those merch badges in the chat, and let's all welcome our five new members. Thank you so much, Justin. Evil Neighbor, member for three months, merch. Thank you for almost half a year. Get that G Fuel ready. Let's go. I do, and I got this. Uh, I haven't tried this flavor yet. Corey was drinking it last week. It's a Naruto flavor. He's right. It's creamy. It's good. I really like this flavor a lot. It's like more of like a... I wish, I wish it would tell me what the flavor is, because I always try to guess, and I'm way off. But it's like an orange, but creamy with like a little bit of tang to it. It's not tang, but it's really good. I like it. Naruto. Thank you, G Fuel. And thank you, Evil Neighbor. Elkanoth, member for one month mercs. Thank you for the continued support. Elkanoth, happy to be here for a few. Glad to see you, bro. Let's have an amazing Saturday night. Hell yeah, thank you. Let's have a good Saturday night. This, whenever I play Resident Evil 2, it's always laid back. It's chill. We just hang out and have a good time. So I think this is gonna be a good one, except I'm gonna be very on edge. And I guarantee you my first playthrough of this tonight is gonna be a little rough. I'm practicing, right? I'm trying to get good. For for people that can occasionally play, it might be pretty good. But I'm just saying, as far as like speed running, it might be a little rough. Just I play better when people aren't watching me, so please don't look at me when I'm playing. Thank you. <laughs> Creamsicle, yes, yes, Creamsicle. 
Doing great, Seth, man. Hope you're doing well. Thank you for coming by. All right, all right, all right. What am I... Oh, like my RPD hoodie? Hell yeah, I had to dress the part. I don't think there's too much else to go over. You know, I talked about everything last night, or two nights ago when I streamed here. Oh, uh, that game I played on Thursday, uh, No One Lives Under the Lighthouse. It was fantastic. It was really good. If you have not watched that video, I highly recommend it. And if you're new to JJ vs. Evil... Uh, same type of content as a row, except I try to play a wider variety of indie games, survival horror games, just whatever looks interesting or cool to me, uh, or even recommendations I play here. So if you're like, bro, all you do is play Resident Evil, yeah, but I also play other games here. So thank you for coming by. Uh, if you enjoy this, you know, hit that subscribe button and that like button, and I appreciate it. Um, so I think without further ado, guys, it's time to get into this because we got to do at least two playthroughs tonight. Arrows, have a beer, brother. And, uh, yeah, let's do it. All right. A anything else? Anybody else got anything to say before we jump into it? Now's the time. Oh, Gabe, 831. Thank you so much for the $5 super chat, man. I appreciate that. Have you seen the Resident Evil 2 remake mod with the classic PS1 graphics demo video on YouTube? I did. It was super cool. And uh, I'm sure you've all seen it by now, but I did reach out to Rustic, and I said I would like to feature that on the row because I think it's super cool, and I think a lot of people would like it. Uh, and he said, yeah, no problem. So I'll probably be talking about it on the row this week. I won't be saying, like, too much you haven't seen, but if you've seen it, it's going to be that, but me, like, giving my thoughts on it. All right, all right, all right. Let's do it, baby. Oh, I'm nervous. Man, I got the pressure. Oh, something about it. Like, I've been streaming for, fuck, man, like, eight, eight, seven, eight, nine years now, and every time I'm, like, about to do a thing, I get so nervous. I'm not really nervous, but I feel nervous. All right, let's do it. Take a second. Almost 200 people here, guys. Thank you for coming by. And almost 100 likes. I appreciate that. Relieving the nerves. All right, guys. We are jumping into Resident Evil 2, the original seamless HD project. Thank you all so much for coming by. I'm going to be trying to play this game as fast as I can. Last stream, I got an hour and 30. Then I played it on my own. I got an hour and 13. I'm probably going to get like an hour and 25. I'm going to try my best, but we're going to play this a few times tonight. Um, I'm practicing for something that I can't talk about yet, but big thing coming. It's going to be exciting. Um, but I'm very excited to to have this opportunity, and I'm excited to practice for it, and I'm excited that you guys are all here, so thank you for coming by. If you guys could please let me know how my audio levels are with the game, I'd appreciate it. And if you enjoyed this video, hit that like. If we had 250 tonight, I'll gift out a Mercs membership. And... Um, Without further ado, let's get into it. But first, Metro Boomin Cam, member for three months. Marks, thank you for almost half a year. Uh, if you beat the first playthrough before the time changes, I'll give you a cookie. I'll take a cookie. Let's do it. Let me get the audio on. Game on. We're going Leon A. That's what's set up, okay? So that's what we're doing. I generally play Claire A, but uh, Leon A it is. Audio is great. Thank you. I haven't started the game yet, but I appreciate that. Okay. I think we're ready. Okay. Original mode, Leon, normal. Here we go. I'm going to forget all the controls and I'm going to be a sloppy mess. I love the cutscene, but we've all seen it. It's about going super fast. So, super fun speedrun. Get out of here, zombies. Get away from me. He's not here. All right, my boy Kendo. Garrett, thank you so much for that gifted Rose Squad Mercenary membership. Please, everybody, Freeze. give it up to Garrett. Let's welcome our new member. Thank you. Who are you? What are you doing here? Grow the Mercs. Hold your fire! I'm a human. Sorry about that, babe. I thought you were one of them. <sighs> Sorry about that. I thought you were one of them. Glad, okay, thank you. What's going on in this town? You can beat it under an hour? Nice. I feel like I can. I just need some practice. By the time I noticed something was wrong, See the that? entire city was starting to grow my mullet out. Zombies. Pretty cool, eh? Practicing. Give me a break. 106 legs? Hell yeah. Okay, and that's that. Get balls. 
Can't do that. So when I actually try, I do go out of my way to grab like herbs and ammo because like I don't have it down to the bullet yet. I feel like um, that's gonna take some time. Um, I'll get there. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be like a Rocky montage. You know what I mean? I might kill an enemy. I don't have to. I might do that. But I feel like um, if I was in the ring with somebody for a speed run, you guys are all in the corner with me. So that's pretty cool. Looks good. Yeah, it's a, yeah this seamless HE project, man, it's clean. Misty, no time to clap your cheeks. We got to move. No! Shit, that never happens. God damn it. Guys, stop looking at me. You're making me nervous. Even Rocky had a montage. You need, I need a montage, dude. I'll get a sweatband. I need that. Just gotta drop his ass. Stay away from my feet. Actually, last time, when I did play this, I got bit like five times here and I still made hour 13. It was so sloppy. Dodge these two. Can't read the chat, I'm so focused. I gotta get somebody here to read the chat for me. I can't be bothered, I, I'm, I'm in the zone. I'm just kidding, I'm reading it. Stop looking and stop looking, looking at you. Yeah, yeah, stop it. Making me more uncomfortable. Oh, oh, thank you. Thank you. You felt like playing video games with the streams are enjoyable? I appreciate I feel I feel that a lot too. Oh man. You know I hate cutscenes I can't skip, you? but it's Resident Evil 2 and oh, it gives me a second to like you must be the new think guy. about what I'm gonna do, so it's pretty nice. Leon. Sorry, but blown out it looks like your party has been canceled no we can still have a party what happened about two months ago there was this incident involving zombies in a mansion oh no located in the outskirts of this city chris and the other stars members discovered that umbrella was behind those dirty everything. bastards they risked their lives to reveal the truth it's a new popular but YouTube video. No Just look up Resident Evil 2 PS1 graphics. Oh, yeah. Not long Just after talking that, about that. All this stuff. Yeah, this, this looks beautiful. Uh, uh, so clean. Hang in there. Actually, you know, there's a part of me that loves me. this. I absolutely love it. I'll never go Just back. But at the same time, when you do go back to the PS1 rooms. on a CRT, it also looks Here. really good. Better than you remember. You'll play it and you'll be like, wow, man, this looks nothing like I remember. But with the CRT screen, it blends the pixels. It actually looks really nice. Just go. Game sounds a bit low. Fine. Shit. But I'm coming back. For I gotta you. turn it up before the game on. starts. All right, it paused the game. We're good. Tell me if this sounds better for the game. Dude, we need this. This freaking just take the seamless HD projects and put them out on console. Fans would do it. Capcom won't. Fans will. Oh yeah, when I was playing, when I got my hour 13 to it and save. So I'm gonna try not to save. If I die, I'll just redo it. And I probably will die because I get nervous. I gotta break my nerves. I got pizza upstairs, Dan. This is a pizza party. Yeah, definitely. Oh yeah, we're gonna be streaming today too. Later today at 5 p.m. Central Standard Time. Deep Fear. On the uh, PlayStation... No, I'm sorry. Se uh, Sega Saturn Survival Horror Game. It's good. We started it last week and it was good. We're continuing. I'm going to watch this cutscene though because I love it. I hope it doesn't count towards my time. I don't think it does. I need to get one of those little time things up top so I look pro. I love wings. I love wings.
the girls wanted pizza for their the their basketball tournament. They all said pizza. I was like, I, I I'm not gonna argue with you. I've seen pro speedrunners not even touch one of these enemies. I can't do that. I have to come through here so many times. Get away. Holy shit, Gary! Gary! GG! With five gifted Mercs memberships. Thank you so much, Gary, for your very generous support. Let's all give it up to Gary and welcome our five new members. Get those GGs in the chat and those Mercs badges. Hell yeah, brother. Thank you. That's it. Fuck. All right, we're done. Wish I, the one thing I like about the remake a lot is you can check your time. When you pause it, you can see how long you've been playing. That's super nice for people that are trying to beat it fast. And a lot of people I've seen over the years, and I've been that same person, I was like, if you enjoy the game, why play it so fast? Like, why not just enjoy it? But I'm, I'm not going to lie. When you get when you played a game over 100 times and you have the route memorized in your head almost, like, perfectly, playing it super fast is, like, a fun new way to play it. Honestly, like, I I used to get it, but, like, now it's like, you got to try it. If you, if you got this game down, try it. It's fun. It's fun to, like, find new routes and stuff. Like, I always enjoy watching these videos. I just never was good enough to do it. And I'm still not good enough. That's why I'm practicing. Okay. Check it. Jesus Christ. That's my biggest thing with this game is, like, I, I don't hit things perfectly right. And he'll, like, not get it. Claire! Leon. It's Has anyone in the chat played the new Resident Evil 4 I bought a while back? It's really good, dude. I, I, I think I guarantee you almost 90% of the people in the chat probably played. It's really good. Your brother's dead. I'm sorry. There's no reason for us to stay any longer than necessary. Let's split up, look for any survivors, and get out of here. Okay. Right. One last thing. Here's a ring. It's fun. Take it. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens. Yeah. No, I, I... Oh, a mod? I'll have to check that out. Are you sure it's a mod or is it just the camera hack? Shit. She talks too much. Bye-bye. I need this. See? I missed things. Get over there. Get over there. Go faster. Come on, drink some G Fuel, Leon. You'll be fine. I don't want to misjudge that. We'll get it later. Because if I break my 113 tonight, I'll probably celebrate. I have a, I, I highly doubt I'll break 113. But if I do, something has to happen. I get got there every fucking time. If I'm trying, I get got. If I'm not trying, I, I make it every time. I don't know what it is. Go away. Bad kitty. I'm gonna spray it with water. What's a plat link? What is everybody saying? Link. Congrats on the link. I missed it. What did, what did I miss? Hell yeah. Thanks. Thanks, Errols. I think the games are like if I play Resident Evil 2 Remake as fast as I can, it's fun. But if I play it vanilla, it's fun. Like it's fun regardless for me. I don't know. Like both both styles are fun. I 
don't know if I should take the out. No, because he always gets me if I go that way. But if I take the in, he gets me too. I think he always gets me no matter what if I come through there running. Oh, you got the RE4R Platinum. Nice. That's what you're talking about. Hell yeah, dude. That's freaking awesome. What? Love the music in this game. This is my therapy right here. It's just playing this. Oh, what am I doing? I'm going to use my bullets on the picture. This is my therapy just playing this game. Footsteps, music, sound effects, all of it. Tyrant Cheeks, member for 30 months. Mercs, thank you for the long time support. Much appreciated. Well, if we're losing an hour, we might as well... Wait, what? We're losing an hour? Well, holy shit. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We're losing an hour tonight? Oh, that's not good. I didn't plan for that. Holy shit. For real? Is that for real tonight? God damn it. It's the worst. You just ruined my night, Tyrant Cheeks. I would have woke up tomorrow and been like, what the fuck? She never told me. Chief Keef, member for 17 months. Marks, thank you for over a year of support, Chief Keef. What's up, JJ? I wish I could get these seamless HD projects working on my laptop. Uh, I always have issues with the zip. Really? I think I think it's not the zip. I think it's just the way you put it, because you have to have the game, and then you have to drop it into the game folder. Are you doing it right? You might be having problems. I don't know. I'm stupid, and I got it to work. I'm not saying you're stupid. I'm just saying I hope you don't have issues, and hopefully you're just stupid. If that, if, that, if that makes sense. It's fucking daylight. God damn it. For real? Why do you do this to me? Yeah, it's Chelsea's fault that we're getting our removed. How dare you? How would you, how, how dare you do this to me on my Resident Evil 2 night of all nights? 2 a.m. to 3 a.m. Ah, oh. Whatever, it'll be fine. I got like four hours of sleep last night and I was good. Oh, Justin with a gift and Mercs membership. Hell yeah, brother. Thank you. Much appreciated. Please, everybody give it up to Justin. Let's welcome our new member. To the Rose Squad Mercs, the real MVPs. Hell yeah, dude. Thank you. Damn it, Chelsea. Everybody in the chat. Damn it, Chelsea. I, I, I've never played the N64 version, and it's kind of crazy. It also feels like it's something I should definitely do, like, soon. How have I never played that version? Like, I know about it, and I know all the bonuses, and I know all that, and I might have played it uh, on an emulator before, but I don't, I don't remember playing through it, like, enough. You know what I mean? Um, actually, I did play it when when I rented it, because I thought it was, like, very different, and when I played it, I don't I didn't really see much of a difference, but I remember as a kid... I rented it and I played it and I was like, oh my god, I can't I can't use this controller. This is terrible. And so like I that was it. I was done after that. And I, I gotta play it again. Because there's so many cool things in that. My favorite costume in this entire series is in that. The Leon Stars outfit. That's so freaking cool. I played the PlayStation version, I played the PC version, I played the Dreamcast version, I played the GameCube version, I played every version. I played the, the Tiger handheld version. I loved that as a kid even though it was trash. I don't care. I liked it. Fuck. Tyrant Cheeks with a $2 super chat. Thank you Tyrant Cheeks for your support. I'm sorry I ruined your night. Here's $2. Okay, you made it better. Now you fix yourself. Don't let it happen again. Don't you dare do daylight savings tonight. Thank you to everybody joining. and hope you enjoy it. See, I have some skills, maybe. Once in a while. I honestly thought I was going to get got there. The only time I can ever, like, make that is when people aren't watching me. Holy shit, Chief Keef 623 with a very generous $20 super chat, man. Thank you so much for that. I greatly appreciate it. Everybody get those Chiefs in the chat. And uh, let me read that once I get a second here. Dude. Streaming gets you really good at multitasking. I didn't know you needed a physical game, but I might be... Oh, that you do. Yeah, you do. Um, I might be stupid, but I thought they were downloaded projects that you can play in the game. I don't know if that makes sense. No, if you get the GameCube version, it will come with the emulator. But if you get the PZ version, you do going to have the, the Source Next version to play it. 
That might be your problem. Hopefully that's your problem. Because then you can fix it. I wish you all the best in, in getting that taken care of. Dude, I, I honestly, though, like, if I'm going to be completely serious with you guys, I think daylight savings is so stupid. I, I get it. It's for, like, farmers and, and all that. But, like, at this point in time, do we really need that? How much help is it doing now? Like, just get rid of the fucking daylight savings. Let's not do that. It's just so stupid. Unless there's something I'm missing. And I, I could be ignorant to something. I don't know. To me, it just sounds... It's fucking dumb. People are going to attack me for that and be like, How oh, fucking dare you? I'm sorry. If, if there's something I, I didn't know. Peck to death. It's time to, I think it's time to end it. Leon's so fucking cool. Bitch. Why my feet? Dude, this game is my feet's kryptonite. I get my feet's munched on more in this game than any other Resident Evil game. I don't need that yet. Hold on. Settle down, JJ. Put the gems in the titties. Get this, then that, then that. Even though that probably would have saved me some time. And speedrunners, they don't ever get those shotgun shells. I get it. I'm not bullet, bullet for bullet yet. I, I still got a little ways to go. I need to get a little extra ammo because I fuck up. <laughs> Hand it! Got it! I think farmers can, like, figure, you know... I don't... <laughs> no, farmers are great. I appreciate farmers. I'm just, I just don't think they still need that. The other guy got his dome stomped. Oh, shit. Thinking. Processing things. Things uh, things are computing in my head right now. I feel like my, my brain is a dial-up modem. And I'm just trying to process where to go next. Ah, oh, lever. Lever is next. Go away. My, my favorite row sweater? Oh, dude. I haven't announced it yet because I'm waiting for it to come in. I want to check it myself ahead of time. But we just uploaded our new uh, revision to the gun shop kendo sweater. And it's... Uh, okay, so you can get two versions of clothes on Cosper. You can get the print, which is the normal standard. And it's, it's generally good. You just can't wash it too many times or the logo starts to peel. Or you can get the all-over print, which is printed right into the fabric. And that'll last you... A, it's more expensive, but it'll last you a million times longer than the uh, other print. And uh, I just did a new design on the Gun Shop Kendo merch all-over print hoodie. And it's fucking sick. Like, uh, I made the logo, and then I sent it over to my uh, designer there, Frank Alcantara. Amazing artist. And he added some nice little touches to it. It's it's super clean, it's super sleek, and it's super minimal, but it's fucking dope. And I, I don't know, that might be my new favorite. Rose Squad right now is my favorite, though. But yeah, Gun Shop Candle merch got updated. You might have seen it. Oh, shit. Bye-bye. But I always recommend you guys, if you have the means and you want to pick up any of our merch, I really appreciate it. You can get the standard merch. It's good. I still have the standard merch. My first ever standard merch. It is fine. But if you want something that, like, maintains, like, the color and everything, like, get the, get the, this is, this, this is exactly like that all over print. It's printed into the material. It'll last you and, and look just like you just bought it so much longer. I'm actually going to be going through all of our merch. And it might go up a little bit in price. I mean, I won't make anything extra off of it, but I would much rather like really good quality merch that like lasts. And I'm, I'm probably going to be switching our standard prints all to uh, all over print. Even if it's not all over, it's just the way that it's printed is way better. It's a, it's a more comfy fabric too, in my opinion. 
Lick her cheeks? What the fuck, Jerrica? Oh, my feet! My brain's going on autopilot. That actually sometimes is good when I'm trying to play a game. Like, I'm just noticing I'm doing things um, properly. Now, sometimes I don't get God here. Other times I do. Get those purple Marvins in the chat. Just kidding. I don't have them on this channel. That's depressing. Hell yeah. Go around them in the back. Go around the back. Nice job. Damn it, JJ. Fucking idiot. Lieutenant Marvin Brana. Piece of shit. I liked you until you got me. Uh, Teespring website is uh, teespring.com slash ROE network. And it should take you right to it. Or just type in Residents of Evil Teespring. And it'll take you right to it. Thank you for considering picking up our merch. <laughs> that guy's drunk. <laughs> Nasty. God damn, I never heard that one before. Gave me a little hickey, yeah. A little love kiss on my way out. My feet! That's not good. That's not good. Holy shit balls. Don't do that. I got it. Oh, my feet! It's the most time I've ever got my feet. Got. He ain't dead. Yeah. Whatever. I'm thinking I did something wrong because I never usually go this route. Usually if I'm going down here, I go the other way, which is a little odd. I feel like I did something wrong. I need that ammo, but I'll get it later. This key is useless! Oh, what did you think of it, Gary? I didn't get a chance to watch that other one yet, but what did you think of Cold Skin? longer what the fuck 230 people here guys thank you so much for coming by hope you enjoy the stream oh no bad dog hit they look like zombies to you feet zombies i get a second to drink my g fuel hell yeah let's go we got the a to scene what are we in guys we're like 20 in I, saw the uniform, I, I love the RPD in Desperate own. Times. I honestly love that scenario, and if that could have remained Marvin's canon storyline, I would have much preferred it over his storyline in Resident Evil 3. And now, doing here? his story in Resident Evil 3 I'm gave that moment so much more weight, but Marvin as a character had way more weight in Desperate in Times, in my opinion. He went out as a hero, whereas he just got got in Resident Evil 3 inside. Remake. Yeah. So I love Desperate Times. I love what they did with the RPD. They added toilets. If we work together, it's we very can good. move this thing. I love, I love that. Give me a hand here, will you? Should have brought the shotgun? For what? Don't you dare question me. This ain't my first rodeo. The captions got you like, what the fuck? I don't generally watch with captions. I don't know what the captions were in it. I don't know if I watch it with captions. It's a really fun, have a few drinks and hang out, watch movie. Did you like it? No one shits on the Resident Evil universe. Goddamn right. But there's a lot of people that do. Oh my God, it's Ada, I love her. I love her. Damn it, I wanted that. Let me guess. You must be Ben. They did right? have toilets. Get up now. Because Corey has the want? same hair type here. that Leon does, not the same color, but he has straight hair. 
and that that might be why. Is this the guy? Ben, you told the city officials that you knew something about what's been going on, didn't you? What did you tell them? And who the cap I, I do watch a lot of movies I'm now with captions, but I never used to. I'd say like John. three or four years ago, I he's never used to watch with captions. Now I do a lot. Based in Chicago, but he suddenly disappeared six months ago. I heard a rumor that he's here in the city. I mean, honestly, I don't talking about anything. remakes, and talking about the modern Resident Evil games and how they don't really need a remake, like five, I don't think it needs it. I'll, I'd like okay, it because of four, but like... There. Honestly, Does six needs it. Where they put the key I, I'd be okay with six getting a remake. I have it Honestly, hundred ten percent. Holy shit! But I'm not about to, to make it horror itself. like Resident Evil Four remake. Those oh. zombies aren't the only things crawling around out But I love the I like the story progression and the characters in Resident Evil Six. There's some things I liked about it. Not many, but there's some things I liked about it. Um, like I said, but I'd still be okay I'm with the remake of six. I think it needs it more than five. Get out of here before you lead it right to me. Hey, twenty four seven watching. Hell yeah. Thank I'm you. the only cop left alive in this building. What? Look, if you want to live, then you're going to have to leave with me. Zero two. Do you even I love Zero's fixed camera scene? angles. I love the atmosphere. The, the gameplay is fun. I like the Inside characters. The I don't like the story. It Go feels too shoehorned in. I think it needs a remake. It won't be and easy. I'd be okay with a little bit of a... All right. Like, I'm normally going. I want beat for beat. I want Resident Evil 1 remake. I want Faithful with added. Resident Evil Zero, I want some adjustments. Yeah, let's do a let's do a reimagining. Zero six, and fuck remake Survivor Lake Seven. That'd be awesome. Where you playing Resident Evil, uh, two player Resident Evil? Oh yeah, I love dude. Corey was the first person that I played Resident Evil Five with. I got it. I worked at GameStop and I got it, and I came home, and uh, we started playing it. And literally, we got, uh, like, addicted to it. It was just so fucking fun and so good that we played it for 13 hours straight. And we beat it. No sleep. And I had to open the next day. So I jumped in the shower, and I head back to work. So I got home from work, played it all night, no sleep, and then went back to work. That was, like, one of the only games I've ever done that with. It was amazing. I've never gotten hit there before. Holy shit. Holy shit. Don't get poisoned there. That would have been really bad. That was the first time that fucker got me. Ada, wait. I don't think I've introduced myself yet. My name's Leon. I'm with the RPD. Lenity, Leonardo, Kennedy, Gary Gray with a very it's generous ten dollars super chat. Thank you again, Gary. Much appreciated. JJ, I have some more Gary Gray love. You Thank you, dude. On shaft. my space, my wallpaper was Resident Evil. Pinned song was Muse, Supermassive Black Hole. Tyrant Cheeks would like that. And my name was Dorian Gray. That's got a nice ring to it. I like that. Dorian Gray. Sounds like a scientist up to something. Like you're you're playing uh Dorian Gray sounds like like a doctor or a scientist. Even thinking Dorian from my wife watch, watches a lot of Gray's Anatomy. I think there's a Dorian in that. What? I've never got got there either. Unbelievable. This game's against me. Dude, when I got that hour 13 too, I was playing with my son. He wanted to play a zombie game and I said, we're gonna play dad's favorite game of all time. And he watched like, he was here for the whole game and he was sitting on my lap and I still got hour 13. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to beat that, but I need to. I gotta shave 13 minutes off of that, minimum. Slop. Dorian Gray, that, dude. It is, it's, it's his actual name. Is it, oh, holy shit. I, I, I didn't put that together in my head. I was just like, it sounds cool, it reminds me of this. That's his actual name. I love a Outbreak remake like Resident Evil 2. 
Yeah, that would be amazing. That or, you know, honestly, they could just port the games to PlayStation. You know, they got Resident Evil 1 director's cut on PlayStation. It's fantastic. It's really good. It's really well done. Um, do that with Outbreak so that people can play it on the servers, and that'd be fine. I'd be happy, honestly. One and two. And then if, if it, they're popular, let's do a file three. You know what I mean? Leon, can you hear me? Zookin's here. Ada, How's it going, Adazookin? Did you find anything? Elder of the row. Right here. <clears throat> hmm. Thank you, Swolfie. I'm glad you enjoyed the thumbnail. Hey, I can't reach the ventilation hole. So style I'm doing on this around. channel to I'll kind of separate the videos later. from row. I can't do the what? exact same style. Ada, wait. Just because it gets too confusing. Eight oh wait. Eight oh wait. Kick drum. Eight oh eight. Clap. <laughs> 808 snare drum, 808 back, got an 808 this and an 808 that. Thank you, Jerica. That's the aggressive one. That's the alpha spider. Gotta beat this twice tonight, guys. Try to do three. We'll see. I didn't know about that time change. We do get a stream tomorrow, too. Or later today, I should say. Crossover with Resident Evil? Oh my god, yeah. That would be fantastic. Honestly, um... Like, everybody asks, like, what remake do you want? I, I think Resident Evil Code Veronica is the most necessary. But what do I want? I want Outbreak. 110%. If, they, if Capcom gave me the, the choice... Outbreak. Gotta be careful here. Let's go for my dome piece. Slow bitch. I don't know why I just talk shit. I'm probably gonna get got. Give me that. I'd rather face a tyrant than a room full of spiders. Oh my god. I hate spiders. You have no idea. I'd break under pressure. Tyrant, at least, I'd, I'd feel like he kind of looks like a human, so he doesn't really throw me off too much. But yeah, no, no spiders. No, no. Hey, Chief Keef, again with another $5 super chat. Thank you again, Chief Keef. Will you give a two minutes short version of what I need to be able to play Resident Evil 3 OG on my computer with these seamless graphics? Just when you go to the website, the Seamless HD Project website, get the uh, get the GameCube version, the Dolphin, because it comes packaged with the Dolphin emulator and it's easier to set up. We need to hit item box. Don't grab my toesies. Yeah, I gotta drop some stuff. Magnum, nice. I'm gonna need that. And I, I should go down there and get all that, but I don't, I don't have enough space. I gotta go drop stuff. I gotta figure out when I actually get this down a little bit more that there's a way to do this without having to drop stuff. Yeah, Zookin. Jesse Duel. No, I never had any bugs or viruses. None at all. No. I, I think for as big of a project is and as passionate as are the, the fans are that made it and all the work they put into it, they wouldn't load it with malware or anything. Just get it from the official website. You don't need to download it from any third party. You can either get it from ModDB or SeamlessHEProject.com or SHDP or whatever it's called. Type in SeamlessHEProject and it'll be the first link that pops up. It might. Some of the fan, some of the fan games and mods will tell you that they potentially have some viruses. They don't. It's it's a false flag with the software they use. I don't go fucking downloading it from some random Facebook page or something. You know what I mean? But generally, you're good. That's not good. That's not good. Shit. Get your dome stomped. Ah! Shit my pants. 
It's really uncomfortable. I didn't wear my Depends. I'm learning. Little things that I mess up, I'm learning. Oh, shit. Okay. Oopsies. Jesse, you just uh, played this the other day, and you did really well. You got like an hour 20-something. That's freaking solid. Yeah, I know what's missing. I'm trying to grab it. Cheers, Wolfie. I see you've been streaming. That's awesome. Hope that's going well. Yeah, a few of your uh, clips and stuff popped up in my feed. Definitely going to buy a hat and a beanie. Oh my god, Elkanoth, I forgot. Thank you, number one. Uh, number two. I'm going to go this way. Yeah. Number two. Um, yeah, we got our beanies and hats back. I, I realized, so they removed it the first time. The second time, they actually didn't remove it. It just went, um, it finished up its cycle and it didn't auto-renew. So when I went through my Teespring, I went through a massive overhaul on our Teespring this last week. There's just so many older things that we had to take care of. I didn't know, I, I wasn't aware of. But uh, I had to relaunch it. So the beanie and the hat are actually back up. It's, for some reason, they're not auto-relaunching. Maybe because it's like a different type of product. I gotta automatic or I gotta do it manually, but yeah, they're up. So thank you, Elkanoth. I don't know why I went this way. It was actually kind of stupid. There's a liquor out here. If I get around him, I'll be fine. That's okay. Just don't do that to me. Eh. I'm faster than you. How's it going, Bernard? 200 likes already? Holy shit, guys. Thank you so much. Glad you guys are enjoying the stream. That's awesome. Nice chill stream. Nice. Thank you, Long Tran. Just finished the Lighthouse stream. What did you think of it? Sick and twisted. I hope you enjoyed it. I really enjoyed that game. Do you have old designs that you never used that might come back? Um, not that I'm aware of. The Resident Evil, the Residents of Evil 2 one will come back. I, I launched that for like a day or two. That eventually will come back. Um, other than that, I, I really don't know. If they do, they're going to come back differently. I'm, I'm very picky and I'm very particular. And if something's bothering me, even if it's fine, but it's bothering me a little bit, I'll, I'll, I won't launch it until I get time to actually make it the way I want to. So like the Gidget you Dome split, yeah, we have a design for that. Uh, we have a bunch of, we actually have probably over 15 designs that I've commissioned from artists. And eventually they will all come out, but I just gotta make sure they're done right. Like the Retro Evil merch, that eventually will come too. I just, I haven't perfected it yet. It's got to be very high resolution. It's got to be very clean. It's got to be minimal, like not minimal or clean, but just like, it's got to be perfect. I'm just, I'm very picky when it comes to like designs. I don't want to have a logo running down one side and the other side and one is off centered. You know what I mean? Like that would drive me crazy. Get away! I think right now our store looks the best it's ever looked as far as like my um, putting my OCD at ease. And I, I was talking with uh, Corey and Bob and I was like, you know, to me seeing red, white, and black for all of our designs, to me, I love that. I think it's like, we're following the style. It's perfect, it's clean. To others, it might all look the same because the row squad is red, black, and white. The row logo is red, black, and white. The gun shop kennel is red, black, and white. But to me, that's Man. that's our style. That's our color scheme. Do you still hear me? Come on, Hell yeah, the OG rules. Favorite game of all Damn. time to this day. I don't believe this. No I console? It's cool that you still have it though, Colonel. <laughs> ben is the throw goat, dude. He's dude. He's uh -huh. got the rat tail. 
Yeah. And he, and he just got dethroned. Yeah, you're right, the Tyron Cheeks. He is, yeah, he's the throw goat. Cold I've never heard that before, but I like it. Good night, Jacob. Get that scum. Get Make that scum. Him pay. Make him pay. Get in there, Did I do good? Chest. It's Dude, I, I want to revisit Outbreak really bad What's right now. Wrong? I do, because they got the two HD texture packs out for uh, for Chapter 1 and Chapter 2 of Outbreak File 2. I'm going to probably do a video on those, just a playthrough of each one with that. Nice, clean graphics. Good God, what was that? Yeah, of course I can still fucking hear you, dude. You don't like a champ, dude. Got split in two. Get your body split. Chemical plant. I have a feeling that's where I'll find John. Ada, wait. Oh my God! How is cats? How is uh, cat zombies? I don't know. I don't think it would be as Do easy you as you think. Clear? We now have access. To I feel like it'd be a smaller room. liquor. That's why I call liquors cats. I'm getting out of here. with a five dollar super chat. Thank you for your support, Swolfy. So Charlie's coming to City for Midwest Classic Gaming. I'm stoked. Yeah, actually, got a few people asked if I was gonna go to that because. Milwaukee's only like three and a half hours away from me. Uh, but we got a big thing planned with Charlie that, that week, and I don't know if I'm going to have time. If I do get time, yes, I'll 100% go. I just know that week is going to be fucking packed. But it would be so awesome. And enjoy yourself there. Uh, have a good time. I, don't, I, I didn't even know there was a Milwaukee gaming event. I don't know. I should know these things, and I should go to them. It's like close to my stomping grounds, you know what I mean? I don't go there all the time, but I do go there, like, pretty regularly. Wish me luck. No save run. Yo, go, Tyrant Cheeks? All right. Well, we might have a big group. If I got a few people that asked if I was going to go, and they said they, they're still going or they will go. That'd be cool. I, I'll look into it. I'll see. I got to check what the dates are. Maybe we could do a big old meetup, plus hang out with Greg, Eric, and Charlie. That'd be cool. So I'm pretty sure they're all going to that. Toad monster! It's a penis. It just got erect. And it's... Oh, it's got its things coming. Oh, God. Get off my dick! Get off... Get off my dick! Get off my ass! Little fucking perverts. Damn it, I missed. That wasn't supposed to happen. This is bad. I don't care. One is better than none. Shit, that's not what I'm supposed to be doing. Let him get me. Oh, fuck you, dude. Get this. Oh, I hate these fucking things. They're the worst. I gotta put him down, though. I don't got. I don't get time for this shit. I gotta get out. I gotta get out of here before he fucking mutates. Gary with the two dollar. Thank you, Gary. Much appreciated, my man. There we go. Hell yeah. I spent way too many of these, but I gotta, I gotta use it if I wanna get through this quick. I just ordered a beanie and a cap too. Oh, hell yeah, dude, thank you. If you guys get any of your merch, take a picture and, and tag us and I'll share it. I appreciate that. The fact that you would uh, pay to rep us means a lot to me. Get them now before they disappear again. Hola, Chuck, how's it going, man? Cleared up some space. All right, cutscene. I'm gonna take a minute to drink my G fuel. Ada. What was that all about? Reckless and stupid. You fucking like stupid ass. And stupid. Those zombies are everywhere. 
Not to mention that thing that got I'll do my best not to die. I, there, Leon. I, I did play it the other day by myself. Look, I got my best time I've ever got, over 13, and I didn't save, and I didn't die. But we're not going to get through this. But we're not saving. The thing is, if I want to do this, I have to do this without saving. So if we die, we have to go back and start over. We're going to try to do three playthroughs, but we're definitely doing two tonight. So like this if you want more. And uh, like this if you don't want more, because I'm going to be doing them regardless. I have to practice. I'll grow a beard and cosplay JJ. Hell yeah, Tyrant Cheeks. Do cosplay. I'll share it. Fucking seriously? Fuck. Ada, get out of the way. I screwed up. What to get shot anyways. Who cares? All right, let's go. Scream if you want it, because I want more, says Jerrica. That's a song. Three three in the morning, the witching hour. Hell yeah, cowboy. Perfect time to be here. And the Magnum, bro? What about the Magnum? It's dope. I love it. I love the uh, Desert Eagle in this version more than the remake. I love the uh, grip on it. I think it gives it a lot more character. That woman was... I have to talk to her. Summer clock is here? Shit. Didn't happen here yet. Or did it? No, it didn't. Oh, it did! It's only supposed to... No, it didn't. Not yet. Oh, dude. Long Tran, you gotta check out the Residence of Evil. I've done a full playthrough of Resident Evil 1.5. The fans took the 70% build, and they finished it. It's, it's amazing. I played it last year, and I played the update. Well, I played the... I played played it in 2022, and then the update in 2023. It's incredible. You gotta watch it. Resident Evil 1.5, Residents of Evil. I have playthroughs of all of it. Swolfie with a $2 super chat. Thank you, Swolfie. JJ needs the power of the cursed taters. Get those cursed potatoes in the chat. I oh, can't skip this cutscene, and that's awesome, because I can take a break. I, I feel like, personally, I feel like I'm doing decent. Like, I'm, I'm not doing as good as I did the other day, but I feel like I'm going to finish up faster than I was expecting. I'm expecting, like, an hour and 20 to an hour and 25. But I might get a little faster than that if I continue the way I'm playing. Remember, though, I need to shave off, like, 15 minutes. Thank you for all the cursed haters. Almost 250 likes, too? Hell yeah, guys, thank you. Let's see if we can get that to shoot up real fast. Smash that like. 250 is a goal. I'll gift out a membership. Oh, dude, it was fully completed. The latest version was way more completed than the 2022 version. It's not full, full, but it's pretty full. I'm going to speedrun Resident Evil 1.5 fan build. Precisely. Literally something My nobody speed running so that I can have the world record. Hell yeah. None of this would have happened if they hadn't tried to steal his research away from him. It's 3 a.m. I must be lonely. I'm I, I'm not gonna skip this cutscene just because I like it so much. Thank you, Kaylee. This way. As long as I beat my personal best even by seconds. Yeah, I did say if I beat 113 tonight, I'm gonna celebrate. Because I, 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 I don't think I'm going to, but I will. No deaths, no saves, beat 113, we're all celebrating. Can I play Resident Evil 1 Remake? All the time, baby. Not not tonight, but yes, I will. 100%. Doctor, we're here to collect the G-Virus sample. Sorry. The likes fuel me, like G-Fuel or G-Virus. You might hit the sample. You might hit the sample. Has Birkins just bleeding out? He's nothing. Gary Gray with another five gifted Rose Squad mercenary memberships. Thank you so much for growing the Mercs. I, I honestly think you're like uh, like the recruit captain of the Mercs with how many people you've brought to the mercenaries. Let's all get those GGs in the chat for Gary and let's welcome our five new members. Bringing us up to a total of 12 members tonight. Thank you, dude. Thank you, Samuel. Appreciate that, man. 
graphics, especially with this upscale, graphics are fucking great for 1998. The, at the time, these graphics absolutely blew me away. Like, they're just so freaking good for a video game. I've never seen anything like that in my entire life. Granted, I never played Resident Evil 1. I, I started with 2, and then after 2, I went back to 1, and I loved 1 so much. But those live action cutscenes were crazy. I was like, how did they do live action in the original game and do CG in the second? I thought the second was amazing. I loved the intro and all the cutscenes in Resident Evil 1 because it was all live action. I thought that was so fucking cool. Dude, I was like, dude, if this was a movie, a full movie, it would be amazing. I, to this day, I still think that. I think that would have been the perfect tone for a Resident Evil movie. B-movie, horror, with practical effects. A little cheesy, a little camp, perfect. He just opened his brown eye. I love so seeing that in Outbreak too. That that intro in Outbreak, that's my favorite that's intro of any Resident Evil game. And it was always three for the longest time. But Outbreak, uh, Outbreak's uh, intro with the piano and the freaking Hunks team running through with the, the rats, oh, that's, that's the best. There's none that I like more. There's a few that are close, but none that I like more than that. And create offspring. Speedrunner RE1? Well, there's a reason why I'm doing two. But eventually, maybe, if I get to where I want to get with Resident Evil 2 and everything goes through properly and I can announce it and tell you guys what I'm, why I'm practicing, then maybe I might come around to Resident Evil 1. Too bad. Too bad. You consume the T-Virus like a tequila shot? Hell yeah, brother. That's a G-Fuel. I was wrong. This way. Gator. Get the sewer gators here. Dude, I did a cosplay of Hunk. When we filmed The Keeper's Diary, we had a legit Hunk costume on set. The... Uh, there was a, the, you'll see it in the film, but, uh, it was, it's over $5,000 and I had to ship it back to him. And I asked, I said, would you mind if I wore it for a stream before I send it back? And he said, that's totally fine. Super cool. Massive. Thank you. Uh, but if you watch our Halloween stream, Halloween, which is crazy, crazy that I did it on Halloween. I was wearing a $5,000 legit Resident Evil 2 remake hunk costume. It was so cool to have it on too. It was so heavy. Big puppies. They're fuzzy. Spank, uh, spank that. Spank that, uh, spider sack. I don't know. It's got a big old fat ass, all right? What do you want me to say? Oh, yeah, yeah, I, I did talk about that uh, trailer, the Keeper's Diary trailer, the final trailer we released. I talked about it more in depth on my stream the other night, uh, but, yeah, I'm very, very happy with the way that turned out, and I'm very grateful for the reception as long as, 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 as well as the team. The team is blown away by the positive reception to that trailer. Like, I've never seen that many positive comments on a video before. Dude, I can't speed run Outbreak. I'm garbage at it. I'll do my best. Yeah, it, it, it's GSM. It's like one to one with the diary. It's it's very faithful. I, I personally, I think it's perfect for like a faithful adaptation of the diary, like a, the the best telling of it in live action you'll ever see. I'd die if I seen a spider that big. I'd roll over and die. That's why somebody said, would I want to fight a tyrant or a room full of those spiders? A tyrant, 110%. No thanks, bro. Ada. Shoot in the water, idiot. Pretty sure it's common in Australia. Australia looks awesome aside from the critters and the evil kangaroos. I could never go because of the spiders. You know snakes? I don't mind at all. Spiders? That's a different story. 
Gary Gray with another $5 Super Chat, man. Thank you so much. Once again, please, everybody, give it up to Gary. As your new recruit captain, listen up. Sound off, you maggots. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Boom, get your dome split. I thought you were going to say uh, maggots. I thought that was a Slipknot reference, and you're going to... Uh, um, one, two, three, four, five, six, 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 seven, eight, nine, ten. What is this? Is this a quote from, um, listen up, you maggots, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Uh, is that, uh, from, um, Full Metal Jacket? Ada, I got shot and you left me there Leon. to die. I seen his tummy. This bullet wound isn't making things any easier. I don't, I think Corey said, yeah. was it Corey that said he really wanted a Resident Evil game in Australia? And then we had a big old conversation about how that actually be perfect. Thank That's you, Samuel. Two, I owe you. 250 Don't people mention. here. Holy shit. Thanks for coming by, I guess. Back with a snack. Hell yeah. I just found out. My. John's dead. That means I'm what? single. That's what Leon heard. Never mind. Get those gators in the chat. Hell yeah, Jerrica and Arginus. Dude, I don't know if you guys watched our Let's Play of Resident Evil 1 with the original cast, but Greg, the actor for Barry Burton, told the story about how he actually strangled a kangaroo in real life that got into the school. He was a principal. And it's one of the best stories I've ever heard in my life. That guy's a fucking badass in real life. And in Resident Evil. I think goals in life are to be as badass as Greg. Yeah. Definitely. Strangle a fucking kangaroo in real life to get it out of the school? <laughs> to keep it away from kids? Holy shit, dude. You ever see those things? are fucking jacked. What's going on on a song? Okanath, have a good night, man. Thanks for hanging out. Brum, brum, brum. That was a badass story. You heard it. Hell yeah. Zombies. Puking all over Ada. Spiders. Move your ass, Ada. You're gonna get pissed on. Oh, this thing always, always a little over with it. An actual hero he is, exactly. I feel like Greg, Eric, and Charlie like play their characters in the game, and their their real life personalities are almost identical. Like it's crazy to if you watch the behind the scenes of the um, Resident Evil reunion video that Andrew put together, like, the way they talk and act is, like, they're actually the characters in real life. It's it's wild. Their personalities are, like, you can tell that Eric's a little bit, like, the cool guy, like, kind of reserved, kind of quiet. He's there for the ride. Charlie's just very, like, charismatic and outgoing and just there, you know, having a good time. Cool guy. And then Greg's just everybody's dad. Like, everybody loves Greg, and everything he says is funny. He's always got a story. Like, it's like, oh my god. You guys are the real life versions of your characters. What the fuck? Hell yeah. Oh my god, the zombie monkeys in Zero? Dude, they're savage. Hey, yeah. Uh, they were very vicious. The zombie koalas? That'd be wild. They'd be too cute to kill. Benny Kage's here. How's it going, Benny Kage? Let's roll. You're playing the part, Gary Gray. You're playing the part of recruit captain very well, though. I will say. It's uh, 1 a.m. for me here. This is my normal time. I'm a night person. I'm like Batman, but like not as cool. Uh, Ada, shoot! Ada, you were supposed to shoot. Shoot that next one, Ada. Fuck! Do something. No, dude, right behind you. Dropped his ass. That's what I'm talking about. I need these parts. I know real speedrunners don't, but fucking A, dude. I love this shotgun. 
It's got the best sound and the best dome splits in the entire series. Holy shit, Active Resident with the 150 pounds. Super chat, thank you for your support, man. I appreciate that. Nothing to say. I just got the weights in the chat. Hell yeah, get swole. It's 3 a.m. now. It's only 3 a.m. for almost everybody here. Holy shit. Shit. Shit, I can't see. Shit. All right. I can shoot this. Hell yeah, dude. I went the wrong way. Fucking butt. That was bad. I shot it for nothing. I'm gonna get got here. That's okay. I'm gonna push him. I'm okay. Exactly what I wanted. Promise. Hey, don't make that mistake. Again. Gotta keep the magnum rounds because I'm gonna get magnum rounds up here anyway, so it doesn't really matter. I'm gonna keep this. And we're good. Alright, wish me luck, guys. I'm going to the boss without saving. Because I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna grab that. I'm gonna grab that. I probably shouldn't, but I should. Uh, I shouldn't, but I'm going to. Whatever. Marshalling Yard. An amazing, amazing area in this game. One of the best. So atmospheric. The music is just fucking chef's kiss. And they cut it from the Resident Evil 2 remake, and I'm still burned by that. I love the game, but goddamn, why would they do that? It was in Resident Evil 0 remake, or not remake, but Resident Evil 0, Resident Evil 2. It was so iconic. They just cut it. Unfucking believable. All right, guys, what do you think my time's gonna be in this? Like, for real. Love this area. Aside from the save room theme, because that's just the most iconic song in the entire series, in my opinion. The marshalling yard's my favorite in this game. It's like, perfect. Just wanted to say that the Keeper's Diary trailer looks very nice. Can't wait to see what you did with the CGI assets. Thank you. Uh, I'm, I'm glad that you enjoyed that. Uh, I think you guys are really going to enjoy the full film. It's it's solid. I've watched it now probably over 100 times, all the different revisions, and I, I really do think it's the most faithful adaptation Eva, of a Resident Evil property. Eva, can you hear me? 1 hour 24? On, okay, Jesse. That it. sounds fair. 69 minutes? Goddamn right. All right, we got Willie B with his jorts. Let's go. He's a bitch. I just gotta not get got. What the fuck? Why are you throwing things? He's having a temper tantrum. That's right, Swolfie. Very much so. It's perfect. Perfect. It's 2 a.m. and just skipped to 3 a.m. Everybody's like fucking... Like me, I had no idea it was time change tonight until Tyrant Cheek said it. And ruined everything. And now everybody's like, what the fuck? This night just got ruined. Two puts him back. Don't fuck around, Leon. Alright, I might be able to get him here. I need three to put him down. Four. My bad. I put him down. I have two more and he's dead. He got his little arms. You see his little T-Rex arms come out? Holy shit. That's so funny. Every time I see his little T-Rex arms come out. What's crazy is my favorite form is where he has all four arms and you literally only see it in this game. It's the most iconic to me. Whenever I think of G, I think of the four arms and you literally only see it, see it for like five seconds. That's wild. Under 115? Hell yeah, Samuel. Don't I'll, I'll try my best. Either. Come Don't on. die on me, Ada. Wake up. Get the fuck up. Come on. That extra hour is going to fuck me tonight because I was I didn't know that and I was like, "Yeah, I can stream till 3 because we got to stream later today." And I was like, "Yeah, I can go to 3 no problem." But now it's going to jump and that kind of throws everything off. 
Beggy's here, road team member. Beggy, what are you doing up, Beggy? You're never up at this hour. Aren't you like 80 something? Go to bed. Thanks for coming by. Hey, Nene and peoples. I'm here uh, in time for my favorite OST and boss fight. That's perfect, Beggy. Thank you for coming by. So I'll get those baggies in the chat. We don't have them here, but figure out a different emoji that fits Beggy. It's my job to look after you. But you'll be in danger if you stay with me. I know Black Mamba I'm in your hand is no joke. Oh, God, stop it. Time, Don't talk about spiders. But I really enjoy being with you. I... Shitload of G Fuel. Yeah, I'll be fine. We're sponsored by an uh, energy want. drink company. I think we'll be okay. I don't want to lose They've got us through some very difficult times before. Wait here for me. I'll be I have like back. a never-ending supply of it. Here we go. We're in the home stretch now, guys. It's just, can I get around the liquors without getting fucked? Uh, can I get around the plants without getting fucked? And can I get past the uh, dog boss? The dog boss actually killed me in my last playthrough. And if that happens, we're just fucked. We have to start all the way over. And if I can get through those three things, I think we might have a solid time. I, I really do. I didn't need to grab that aid spray. Remember that going forward, JJ? You do not need that aid spray. Get one there. Stupid. G Fuel coffee takes uh, too long and tastes like mud. Mine does. Yeah, I mean, there's so many flavors. I'm drinking the uh, Naruto flavor and I really like it. It's my first time drinking this flavor. should see Beggy's other avatar, the one where she has like five chins. That one's way cooler. And accurate. <laughs> the pupper willy boss is dangerous. Oh yeah, like if you get caught in the wrong spot. Like I always have plenty of magnum rounds for that, but if you get caught, you're kind of screwed. Like you just gotta heal in time. I go into that with three uh, eight sprays. And sometimes if I don't heal in time, it's still not enough. That's probably my, yeah, that's like out of all the things in this game, that's the one like where it can really get me. These things though too, sometimes they'll shoot a poison at you that you, you miss the auto aim and you're screwed. Like right there. See that? How oh, he didn't auto aim when I pulled it? That could screw you. That one didn't die. That could have screwed me. Uh, Gary with a $10 super chat. Thank you so much for your support, Gary. One hour and 10 minutes. Holy shit, man. I'm going to try my best. Thank you for that. Everybody hit like it. Like his, like his nice thing he said. Sometimes these take one hit. Sometimes they take two hits. It's very odd. Plant 69, baby. Hell yeah. That plant is fucking the dirty plant. You want some too? Where's your friend? He's gonna catch one of these super shotgun rounds to the dick. Hell yeah. That actually went super well. Might be one more. Nope, we're good. Oh, right here. Comes later. It's getting intense. Got some more plants coming up and some more liquors. Just gonna drop it quick. I want a fucking knife. Yeah, it's less since I was talking during the start of the stream, so that's kind of inaccurate to go off of. I can get past this one, 
But if I don't kill that one in there fast enough, then he'll get me. Probably should use a shotgun, but whatever. So you gotta cut that fast. Oh, I almost got hung up. And grab this without getting got to if I'm fast enough, which I might not be. Oh, I was. Holy shit. That G Fuel, baby. Makes you a better person and a better player. Oh, shit. Bad timing. Bad timing. Hell yeah, dude. And then I have to fire a single round. I gotta try not to get got by the plants up here. One hour 34. Okay, now you're being rude. Hell yeah. Fuck balls. I need some space for this part coming up. I don't know if I have enough. I'm learning, alright? We learn as we go. Take them out now so I have to deal with them later. Breeew. Actually, there are naked zombies in here later. So I could have ran past them. Damn it. Hands cramping. I'm playing too hard. I'm playing too focused. Laser focused. I need to get, uh, uh, what is that? Uh, when you're in a boxing match and you got your um, coach that gives you water and the other guy rubs stuff on your face, I need somebody to come, like, hand me a pizza so I can eat it. And somebody else to, like, get my vape in my mouth for me because I can't be bothered. Holy shit, go, 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 go. That one's not a threat. Oof. Awesome thumbnail, thank you, Actual. I appreciate that. I've been doing a new style and I think it's, it's it's coming out pretty good. Oh my God, St. Patty's Day, March 14th? Is that what it is? Holy shit. We'll be live drinking green beer. Can't see. Dropped his ass. He's gonna get up and eat my feet. There's like 10 of them over here. This is where I tear through all my pistol ammo. There's always that one that lingers around there, just fucking around, and he never comes out. He always gets me. Burn the pistol ammo now. Oh, he's dead. I actually fucking got him this time. Holy shit. Damn it. No space. Oh, I, I guess I don't need that. What do I got in here? Damn it. I really... I, I need three aid sprays for the finale just in case. I ain't gonna have it. You. Fuck you! No, you! you. That'd be really husband. bad. I know what I'm gonna go right now. Looking for. You came for the G virus, didn't you? You'll never take it from me. This is my husband's legacy. Now, where's that spy you were working with earlier? You know who I'm talking about. What? You really don't know anything, do you? <laughs> You're so gullible. She's one of the operatives sent here by the agency. The only reason why she came here is to obtain the G-Virus. That's a lie. No, it's the truth. I discovered this when I did a background check on her. She specifically got close to John and became his girlfriend to get information about Umbrella. That can't be. I know her. Ada wouldn't do something like that. If you don't want to believe it, I don't really care. You're about to die anyway. What happened?
I just speed ran peeing. Hell yeah! Get her! Fuck you, Annette. She dead. The self destruct self sequence. sequence has been activated. Repeat, the self Everybody dance. Sequence has been activated. This sequence may, may not, not be aborted. aborted. All employees proceed I do chair is actually really good at games. Sometimes I'm not here and he just beats the game in like two seconds. I don't know what happens. Cheats. Kind of a piece of shit. I like this Annette better than the remake one. I, I, I think I liked her better in the remake just because she had a little bit more to her. I don't know. Like, she was still a piece of Leon. shit and I hated her. But I liked her a little bit more in the, in the, in the remake. I've been waiting for you, Leon. She's more determined in the OG. What are you doing? She... You I don't know. know. I felt like she served her purpose pretty well so in the remake. Just hand over the G virus. I don't believe this. Annette was right. About everything. That's why I told you to leave without <laughs> He seemed not very friendly. 100% our genus. How's it going, Don't Cosmo Pox? Shoot you. you can't do that. <laughs> Annette was laughing a minute ago, and look at her now. Dead. Not really, though. She's got one more left in her. Saved it for Ada. Ada. You guys ever watch that Ada. video of what happens Fight. when Leon drops Ada? Don't give up. And it's the extended cut she. where she like bounces off a bunch of fucking pipes the whole way down. It's great. It's I, as a kid, I don't remember I hated this alarm, but like now thinking about it, I always love this alarm. Make it. I actually was in a band before I started the Residence of Evil. It was a metal band. I was the vocalist, and I was remixing one of our songs, and I added the, the self-destruct no. sequence, and then it I kicks into our song. It was called escape. Outbreak. You just have to help me it was out here. Uh, very uh, inspired by Resident Evil, <laughs> obviously. It actually worked pretty well, too. I'm still pretty, pretty happy with that. That's good, Cosmo. Ping, Ada! ping, 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 like a uh, plinko, just bouncing all the way down. So this is what everybody's been dying for—the G fuel. Don't be a bitch, Leon. So this. I think has gone, dude. He yeeted that into non-existence. Fuck. I screwed myself. I have to go back to the item box down here. It's not that far away, but it's just unnecessary steps. I ain't taking any risks. No chances. No survivors. No, they don't, they're, they're, they're not together anymore. I work with everybody that I was in a band with. Uh, they all work at the same place as me, uh, but uh, they're not doing anymore. Um, the drummer had two kids. Um, Mike joined another band. Fuck, who else is in it? My buddy Tyler uh, and the drummer don't get along at all. And uh, I don't know what happened to the other the other guy they had. Oh, he was, he's really bad at something. I don't, I don't remember. Can't see. I can get around this guy. Fuck me. I'll come back. I gotta drop some shit. I gotta get my... I gotta get the right supplies. I should've just used a shotgun because I'm gonna ditch it here anyways, but whatever. And I do really want to get that... Green herb, because I, I can't go into that on caution. That'd be reckless and stupid! Hell yeah, I got perfect. I'm set. Dude, I might be able to get through this. In good time. I think this guy might actually reset. So he might be a little closer to me than I would like, but I can. Probably should grab the shotgun just in case this isn't enough or I miss, but whatever. It's too late now. That was bad. That's bad. Mm. 
Fuck off, naked zombies. God! Sexual harassment. Pro HR. Get him. A little sloppy, but that's okay. I think I'm still doing decent enough to where if I can get through this, we'll be okay. It's really, this is the biggest thing because out of this entire game where I might accidentally die is always here. It's always here. And no matter how many times I play this game, it's always here. So this is a moment of truth. Wish me all the luck that you can wish me. Fuck. Now I'm getting nervous. Yeah, I'm thinking 120, 125. I don't know how the fuck I got 113. Took that like a champ! That was bad. Stupid asshole. Doggy time. I don't know if it was not a good thing that I got hit there. I almost never get hit there, so I don't know if that might fuck this up. I might take my time here, honestly. I might take my time and just try to get away. Take like a shot or two. And then hide. Power. I don't know if I hit him. No, 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 get up. And heal. Oh, ho, ho, ho. good lord, don't do that to my heart. I'm too old. Hang it. Cut it! No, no, you don't auto- Ah, uh, ah, uh, I need you to auto-aim. Fuck you. One more. You won't get me. Ah, he didn't get me! Holy shit! And I had three more. Count better, JJ. Come on. I missed. What the fuck was that? Cheating, bastard. Yes, let's go! Woo! All right, we're in the home stretch. Now it's just what my time is. Let's fucking go. Sloppy as fuck. Fuck you, Sadamnus. I, I appreciate you. Yeah, asshole. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> Gary Gray with a $10 super chat. Thank you so much, Gary, for your very generous support. Once again, oh my God. I do have footage of the band. Just type in uh, The Virus Within on YouTube and you'll find it. Holy shit. Holy shit. Yeah, there's two channels for it. They had a new one, and then there's the old one. The old one I was in. This is before, right before, shortly before I started the Residence of Evil. Honestly, I think I was part. I was in it for a little bit during the Residence of Evil, at the very end, and then I had to back out because I was working weekends and we could not do shows. I I, I just didn't have time. Let's fucking go. Uh, from time to time, I used to go to see local bands. I met Alice Cooper's daughter. Cal oh, that's awesome. And Chuck Garrick, Alice Cooper's a bassist. Dude, that's dope. Uh, band Vito Blanco. That's dope. We're gonna watch this just so I can close it out and, you know, be happy. We're gonna take this time to chill. Remember I said, we're beating this twice tonight for sure. Maybe three if we have time. If my time is under 113, I'm gonna be so happy. We're gonna celebrate somehow, some way. Might do an after party while we play, while we play the second run. I don't know. We'll see. Okay? Let's go, baby. Yes. I think, I honestly, I think it's gonna be like 120, 122, maybe. There's a few times I got got. I didn't get got the last time I played. So I, I, if it's if it's under 113, I'll I'll be shocked. I'll be shocked. But I do feel like it's gonna be close. I feel like it's gonna be close. I said 145. I personally feel like 145 is way off. But 113 is my fastest. I gotta beat that. Yeah, 113. I was just hanging out down here doing some work and my my son came down he's like dad i want to play a zombie game and he's he's very much a little me honestly and so i started playing this and i literally in one sitting i beat it and it got my fastest time i ever got 134 it's a little rude all right let's just skip this to see what it is all right here we go moment of truth come on what's it gonna be 120 125 Come on, dude, this, the suspense is killing me. Okay, 
Okay, I didn't beat 113, but 118 is still not bad. That's actually faster than I thought. I just gotta figure out what can I shave off of that because I honestly, my fastest time, 113, I still need to shave 15 minutes off of it, honestly. So right now, I would need to shave like 20 minutes off of it. What would I shave? I feel like that went pretty decent. I will say though, I'm, I generally am a little different off cam than I am on cam. I'm a little more laser focused than I am, so I need to get good at playing the game and interacting with chat, you know what I mean? But uh, that's still pretty solid. I'm pretty happy with that. Thank you, Link Master. Welcome to the Mercenaries. Uh, spam those custom emojis. You've unlocked them. Let's all welcome Link Master to the Rose Squad. Hell yeah, brother. And there's my last one right here, Claire B. All right. We're going to try to beat that. We're going to try to beat that. We're going round number two. We're going to beat 118. I got to play it. Oh, I got to play it so good. All right. I'm recapping now. Recapping where I, I... There was a lot of areas where I was like, I can do that better. Holy shit. Jesse Duel with 10 gifted mercenary memberships. Hell yes, brother. Thank you so much for that incredibly generous support. Please, everybody, give it up to Jesse Duel right now, who just gifted 10 memberships. And let's welcome our 10 new members to the Mercs, the real MVPs. Let's get those merch, Mercs badges going crazy in the chat. Hell yes, dude. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. All right. I'm going to grab a drink real quick. I'll be right back. I'm going to I'm gonna chat with you guys for like five minutes, and then we're going to jump into uh, playing it again. Uh, we're going to play it again. Um, I, I got to go through in my head. What do I want to shave? What do, I, what do I want to cut? I played it almost exactly like I played it the other day. I just did it slower. Hmm. 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 I'll be right back. Talk to chair. Everybody celebrate in the chat. That was I'm I'm pretty happy with that time, honestly. It was faster than I thought I would. A little liquid courage. Alright. Almost done. 277 people here, guys. Thank you for coming by. I'm just gonna grab a drink and I'll be right back. Quieter. Don't go down here. Get out of here. Go back upstairs. Try to back. Okay. Gotta be a little quieter, guys. I'm keeping the kids up. I didn't, I did, I, my daughter's used to it. You know, me yelling. It's not too loud up there, but generally, if you're not used to it, you can hear it up there. And one of her friends was like, I can't sleep. You're too loud. <laughs> Oops. All right. What was I going to say? Um, chair is a real trooper for absorbing all JJ's farts. <laughs> I'm just farting in it constantly. <laughs> no, I'm not. That's gross. I think chair hates the time change, just like every single other person out there. The only time it's good is when it works in our favor, but we always know. We always know that it's coming back to get us. We always know that. Gotta go good night. Good night, a band. Appreciate you coming by. Hope you enjoyed it. Um... Damn, man. 23 members we're at right now. That is insane. And, you guys, I, 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 I forgot to check it. We're at 270 likes. We absolutely crushed the like goal. Uh, it was 250. We're at 270. Definitely keep it going. Let's see how high we can get it for Resident Evil 2. And if we don't break 300 for Resident Evil 2, honestly, I'll be offended. But I appreciate the likes. Thank you, guys. I'm going to gift out a mercenary membership now for that to show my support and my appreciation. All right, here we go. I'm sending out a Mercs membership right now. And uh, if we hit 25 members, which we're one away, I'll gift out another membership. So hell yeah. This puts us at 24. One more member, and it'll be 26 then. Thank you, guys. Uh, all right, let me think. So the biggest thing that I'm trying to go through in my head is just play it. Just play it. I might get a little faster. I might get a little slower. But at the end of the day, all this, all this repetitiveness of playing the same game over and over is going to help me. I, there was a few times where I got 
hit where I normally don't. I'm going to try to avoid that. There was times when I played this before, I got hit like four or five times at the beginning of the game and I almost never get hit there and I still got my best time. So honestly, like it's, 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 you got to play through the whole thing to really see how it's going to play out. I know a lot of speedrunners that are really trying, if they get got once, they're like, you know what, starting over. And uh, I've seen other speedrunners where they got gotten, they're like, I've never gotten hit there and they get their best time. So I think I'm just going to, I'm just going to do what I just did. And I'm going to try to take what I learned from that and, and implement it somehow. But there's nothing too crazy that I can change. Where can I download this mode? Uh, it's actually just type in Resident Evil 2 uh, Seamless HD Project. It's all, uh, it's online for comp PC only. Um, I love the intro to Resident Evil. Resident Evil. Resident Evil 2 is my favorite, but goddamn, Resident Evil is so goddamn close. The original Resident Evil is so close. I just listened to it today. And I was like, that's so good. Uh, all right, all right, all right. Uh, yeah, Claire A and Liam B is a real canon. I agree. Totally agree. I, I'm well aware, but uh, this is what we've uh, agreed upon is Leon A, so that's why I'm practicing it. All right, so thank you guys all for coming by. We're going to try it again. We're going to try it again. I got to beat... Uh, I don't have to beat 113, but I do got to beat 118, so that's the goal. Swolfie, thank you for that $2 super chat, man. Much appreciated. You should get live split to keep it time for your run. I, I think actually... Now that I'm starting to practice this, now that you guys are aware I'm going to be practicing this more, I will. I will. But at the same time, it's super nice to see. I played that a little faster. I played that a little slower. You can tweak and get better. Sometimes, though, it gets in your head. Sometimes it gets in your head. Like I said, sometimes you might have a terrible intro, and you might have a solid outro. Uh, but I, I will definitely get it. I actually didn't know that's what it's called, live split. Good to know. Thank you. All right, guys. Part two. Round two. Ready, fight. Wish me luck. Here we go. Wee. We got this. We got this. Watch me get hit by the first zombie. Just kidding. He's there. He wasn't there last time. What the fuck? Sometimes this game throws you curveballs. Freeze. Yeah, I'm getting alone in the dark. Definitely. Definitely. Hey, what are you, what are you doing, doing here? Hold, Hold your fire. fire. I'm, I'm a, a human. human. Having a drink now, guys. Oh. Cheers. Sorry about that. I thought Absolutely not a world record. This game's been beat in What's like 45 in minutes. Town? Hold on. I don't have a clue. Glad you feel better, Jerrica. Jeopardy new joining, guys. Thank you for coming by. Was infested with zombies. Screwed up here last time. <laughs> no, Kendo! Why do I gotta keep her living this tragedy? <laughs> Grab that and go. Alright, let's go. I actually don't know if I absolutely need the ammo here. That's intentional. That's not intentional. That's okay though. Drop him. That was way faster than going and grabbing the ammo. All right. I'm gonna try to see if I can get through this big chunk here without grabbing that ammo. I got hit twice there instead of once, but that still is faster. We really got to cut. We really got to cut a lot of the fat. That was great. That was great. I usually got hit there, there and that, that was perfect. That was great. Perfect. That was super fast. That was really good. That was bad. That was really bad. Son of a bitch. Oh, no. I'm just... Okay. That's not terrible, though. Got hit one time more than normal there. I think that's fine. I think uh, the intro made up for it. Since I don't fucking get hit here. That'd be terrible. Right to Marvin. Right to Marvin. Greetings, Elon. 
Uruguay. Oh, the RPD, man. I love that. Just looking up at it with that music, it just hits. It just hits. This game's a vibe. <laughs> Restart. <laughs> I haven't gotten to that point yet. Oh, All right, man. got a minute here. Maybe maybe a little bit of the, you know, the adult drinks might help you? me relax a little oh, bit. But not too many. It's like a very... Just like Leon. when I used to play Halo competitively all the Sorry, time. But Every Thursday night, my like buddy would come over after school. We'd play it all night. What happened? I'd have like one or two beers, About right? Two It'd get me leveled ago, out perfect. Not drunk, but was this but a little buzz, just enough to just relax. Zombies. And I'd go right into the zone, man. In we would. Mansion, we were so heavy into Halo SWAT. And then after that, man, we would. Chris, I'd, I'd buy a six pack. We'd have two beers and play Halo SWAT. That after that, we'd go lay on the couch. I'd, I'd drink the rest of the beers. He'd drink everything. the rest of his beers, and we'd watch Ancient Aliens. <laughs> that was our Thursday, dude. Every but Thursday no for like a year, we'd play Halo SWAT all night until a certain that, time. We'd lay down. We'd watch Ancient Aliens. We'd watch the happen. first episode. The second episode, we'd both fall asleep, and we'd go to school Hang the next day. That was it. Was one of the me. coolest routines I've ever had just in my life. Rescue the survivors in the other rooms. But just a little bit yeah. always got me on that perfect calm card. level. You should be able to Gary Gray with a five dollar super chat. Thank you again, now Gary. Go. I'm doing a supply run right. for now and a Sunday Just stream. Go. Be right back. Will you beat your time? You will beat your time. Thank you, Gary. Fine. I appreciate that, man. And but good I'm luck on your supply run. You. Just hold on. Oh, what really? Your brother was Halo, uh, dude. That was when I was in high school. Halo was huge. It was huge. Like uh, I remember when Call of Duty and Gears of War took off for a bit there, but Halo was always like go. That that's where it was at. It's a little sad to see, you know, it kind of slide since then. I always loved Halo. But, you know, I, I get it, too, at the same time. I played Halo 5's campaign. Such a, It was such an upset. The, the, the multiplayer was great, though. In Halo 5, it was fantastic. Um, I know a lot of people will disagree with me, but I think 4's campaign might be my favorite. Um, but Reach, man, I probably put more hours into Reach's multiplayer than I have in any other Halo game. Yeehaw. Getting that slight buzz definitely does help. I used to play Smash Bros. competitively, and when I was buzzed, I played so good. That's what it was, too. And it's like, I never, like, I had a whole case of beer there. If I was, like, stressed out, I could have drank the whole thing. But I always was, like, just level, level. In between breaks, take a little sip. You know, like, it was, like, perfectly balanced. I was very, like, um, focused on just being good. Nothing else but being good. So, like, it, it eventually became, like, a way to just, like, get in the element, like, in the zone. It was, like, the most I've ever been competitive at a game before. And I had it, like, I had it down to a science. Yeah, Reach was peak multiplayer game. 110%, dude. She went down fast. She's dead. She's twitching. I don't even need you. You can just stay alive. That's fine. I don't got time. Yeah, I miss those days, though. Like, that was, like, uh, one of my favorite gaming moments. Like, you know, you always have yours, like, uh, the first time I played Resident Evil 2, first time I played Grand Theft Auto 3, first time I played The Sims, the first time I played Minecraft. Like, I have so many. The my, I got super into Far Cry, but, like, Halo, Halo's multiplayer. Always from, like, the first one, second, like, all of them. They've always, like, uh, uh, land parties. Like, they've always had, like, a super, super good memory for me. Halo 4's multiplayer was really good, too. I don't think I played it as much as Reach, but very close. Very, very close. I actually probably had some of my, my best matches in 4. Smash was one, Smash Bros. I was one that my cousins played a ton, and I never really got into. I never really got into it. Yeah, it's it's super it's cool, and I played it now with the emulator and stuff. I just, for some reason, Smash was it, it was so chaotic. Like There's so much going on. I remember with the Halo though, when uh, some of my friends got into Gears of War, I was very like, started to get disappointed 
And then I started getting really good at There's Gears no of War, and I was like, all right, this one's good. I like this one. And then everybody like, shifted to Call of Duty, and so I, I went to a Halo LAN party, and they were playing Call of Duty, and I was like, right. the same for me one no more. Thing. I'm getting old. Here's all radio. these, all these, they, they were a grade younger than me with some people from that my grade, but the majority of them were a grade younger, and I was like, that was the first time I ever felt like, man, I'm getting... Maybe I'm 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 aging out, you know. <laughs> like that was the first time I felt that. Gaming's not what it once was <laughs> two years ago. Mario Kart 64, that game, yeah, that that one was great. Gears is so, I, I, for some reason, man, I got that down really well. When I started, like, cleaning up house, I was like, all right, this might be good. I might be into this. And then, and then, uh, Corey's older brother and I went through and we grinded out all the Gears games co-op. And we had such a blast. I, I really do like that series. Not at first, but, uh, coming around to it, I think it's me getting good at the multiplayer what got me into the game. And then going through and, um, playing the story, you know. Like, got me into it. How the fuck, dude? How the fuck? I'm not speedrunning, not doing anything. I always get past her. But when I'm trying to go fast, they always get me. It's like they know. A year is nothing, though. I know, right? But at the time, man, it was definitely something. It's way too early to tell, but I will say so far, better than the first round. Definitely. Hey, we got Andy here from Screenfire Germany. How's it going, man? The second hands always get me. The second, yeah, that, got it. I don't know what it is, man. That's my kryptonite, those second hands. Always. How's it going, man? Thanks for coming by. You can definitely avoid those arms, and I usually always do, unless I'm trying to go fast. Then I can't. Shit balls. Alright. Go fast, go fast. I'm gonna try to take the outside. The inside, actually. Oh, no, no matter what. If I go on the outside or the inside, he always gets me there. Always. Inside, outside, don't matter. never played halo yeah it was i know like a lot of people probably that didn't grow up or, or you know go to school around our high school around uh like the mid 2010s probably never played it but for me in like within the age group that i was in it was very popular I read a lot of the books too. Like uh, I just love that that lore, that world, all of it. The flood too. That was like that was like horror. You think of Halo, you think of a very action-heavy game. The flood is, and especially if you read the books, the flood is. It's like a horror game. Kind of like Half Life. Half Life does. I don't know if any of you played or watched Half Life Alex, but I was actually surprised that game is more of a horror game than it is an action game. Half-Life Alex is is it very, you know, in VR, it's very like scary. Uh, I, w I wasn't expecting that. I was very pleasantly surprised. I like. I never watched the Halo show. I seen a lot of things on it, and that made me not very happy. So I avoided it. Can't shoot that gap. Can't shoot that gap. You fucking idiot. God damn it. That was. Not good. Not good at all. Took your arm though, bitch. Danger. It's coming. Man, I'm playing. That that was so slop. Slow. Started off so strong. So slop. It's because Andy's here. He's making me nervous. Get out of here, Andy. I appreciate you. Go away. You, it all makes sense later. 
there's a trick. If you have to walk two to three steps at the corner, then start running, even if the liquor it can't hit. Really? Oh no, shit. Thank you for that. I did not know. I did not know that. That'll actually help a lot. Hand it. Yeah, no, I, I, I agree with that. Of all VR games or like Half-Life Alex, I would only play VR. I, I wouldn't only play it, but I'd play it so much more. Half-Life Alex is hands down the definitive way to play VR, if you can. That game is like perfectly, perfectly made for VR. Where like, like Resident Evil 4 and Village and PSVR 2, it looks gorgeous. It's so much fun. It's so immersive, but it's not true VR. True VR is where you can interact with all the 3D models around you. The only game I've ever played like that, there's a few actually, but Half-Life Alex has done it the best. It's it's so fucking good. Too good, actually. I don't like no, I actually I think it'll be okay. Damien Keith, member for seven months. Mercs, thank you for over half a year, dude. Insomnia has its perks. Thanks, JJ, for streaming. Uh, RE2 quote of the night. Get that scum. Make him pay. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. Thank you. Oh, I know that all too well, that insomnia. I normally wouldn't have to go here, but, uh, you know, doing a little rough. Thank you. And Kung Fu Hot Dog, thank you for that five pound. Much appreciated, my man. Let me grab these now. Oh, he's gonna get my hair. Go. Hell oh shit, he got my hair. Son of a bitch. Alright, we're pushing 125, guys. 125. I was running there too. I'm jinxed. Uh, JJ. You're the best. Do you think Capcom will announce Resident Evil 5 Remake soon? I love that game and I always laugh when people talk about Chris being buff. Uh, dude, I, I love that game too. Um, I don't think it'll be next. I think it's going to be Resident Evil 9 next, definitely. If I had to put money on it, Resident Evil 9. I've been wrong before. I've also been right. But I, I do think Resident Evil 9. Uh, will they remake Resident Evil 5? I mean, based off the ending of Resident Evil 4, I think it's a no-brainer. But I will be severely disappointed if they skip Code Veronica. I'll also be shocked if they remake Code Veronica. Shocked in a good way. If I can get through here, I'll be okay. Whoa! Whoa! Never before, never before. Never before. This is bad. This is very, very, very bad. Poop. There goes my time, guys. It's done. Just a few little mistakes like that, and now it's over. Son of a bitch. The crows are gonna get me. I might as well restart. You know what? I'm gonna restart right now. While we're we're uh while we're still I can I can start over way faster than I can trying to salvage that, definitely. Alright. Um Normally, I said sometimes you have a rough start and a really good outro, but when it gets to a danger, it ain't even worth it at that point. Uh, boot this up. And you know, I it might just be too. It might just be that uh, I might only be able to like give it one one good go, and the second go, I'm just too loose. I might not I might not be on my my game enough. I don't know. I'm fig I'm figuring it out as I go. Shit. Let's try it again. Skip, skip. It was a really good start, though. I played that intro part pretty well. Don't be there. Don't be there. He's not there. Why is he there sometimes and not other times? Freeze. Who are you? What are you doing here? God damn it, it's three in the morning? When did that happen? Human. It was two o'clock. Now it's three o'clock. 
Son of a bitch. I was supposed to go I was supposed to go to bed by three. <sighs> Fucking daylight savings. Oh, Unbelievable. I thought you were one of them. You guys, we broke What's 300 likes. Hell yeah. Town. Thank you so much, guys. Glad you're enjoying the stream. I don't have a hey, I'm no, I ain't got no clue, darling. By the time I noticed something was wrong, but don't you worry, you'll be safe in here with me, girly. Infested with zombies, babe. <laughs> no, Kendo. <laughs> Perfect. I wish I could get my best time on stream. That'd be fantastic. Uh, Hell yes, that was perfect. Uh, perfect, perfect, perfect. Come on, PB. Hell yeah. Perfect. <laughs> Two shots, not three. Oh, two shots! Holy shit. The game definitely changes. I think there's two variants of this game, honestly. Sometimes it takes one shot to kill the plant, sometimes it takes two. I notice it always takes two when you don't have that zombie by Gunshop Kendo. I don't know if that's a real thing, but I've noticed it. Otherwise, it's always one. I've only got bitten once, which was planned. That was a perfect intro. Thank you, Andy. I'm trying my best. Let's go. Thank you, Baggy. I got a lot of practice to go, but I will get there, hopefully. Uh, Did I nail it? Oh, uh, who, who are you? Oh, oh, you must be Claire. You must be the new guy. He's dying. Leon. Sorry, but... Never seen it, Kevin. It looks like your party... Thank you for that $5, Damien. Much appreciated. My cat, Flynn Ryder, which is About a cool name, ago, enjoys watching and listening to in JJ. Row Pets Unite. Need to get him a row bandana. That is dope, and it's crazy the, the amount of people of that city. let me know that their cats or dogs Chris like watching the stream and the other stars i might have a voice for cats and dogs i don't know what it is but that's cool was behind everything i'm a they cat and dog whisperer to reveal the truth but no you can one call me jj them. whisperer there's Not probably a cooler name that, i could have all this started to happen in west uh, raccoon city uh, born and raised hang in there don't worry about me just rescue the survivors. Since we already got a pretty solid playthrough, 118. Here, take this key card. I'm gonna have a few drinks. You be able and see to if it helps. The doors in the it won't. This. But I'm gonna try it. Now go. But just go. Fine. <laughs> but I'm coming Marvin's, back for you. He's seen just things. He must be Claire. Oh man, he's he's gone. He's a goner. I am. Uh, I love dogs. I really do. But I'm a cat person. It's the way I was raised. I had a dog when I was so young that I barely remember. Love the dog. He got hit by a car and died. I remember this. The first saddest day of my life. I remember it to this day. When I found out that Max got hit by a car and died. I don't remember the dog very much. I don't remember a lot. But I do remember finding out that he died. And that was the first day of my life I was devastated. And then I had a cat for the majority of my life. Tyrant Cheeks with a $5 super chat. Thank you for your support, Tyrant Cheeks. Uh, gotta also enjoy... Uh, Gato also enjoys your streams. I leave YouTube on for her when I go to work. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you. That's cool. That's cool. It's 
I'm going to remember two to three steps. You walk there, and the liquor won't get you. Piece of shit. Take him out now. I always do better if I just take him out now and not, not have to worry about it later. That guy took way more rounds than he should have. Maybe three to four steps. Okay, that's better to, better to know. I will come back through for those herbs, so it's probably better to get rid of them now. How's it going, Jerem? No, you bitch. Not enough. Always do three. Son of a bitch. Yeah, you had dogs your whole life? Yeah, so definitely a dog person. It wasn't until I was probably uh, 13 or 14 when we got a dog, Duke. Uh, he was an awesome dog. He's really fat. But he's a super cool dog. Uh, and we had him for like two years. And then my mom could not deal with dogs. He was just too pesty or something. And they had to get rid of him. And I was devastated again. He was such a good dog. And then one day I got home and he wasn't there. And I was like, yeah, I kind of expected that. It was going to happen sooner or later. Leon. What do I think of soccer? It's super fun. It's a lot of fun to play. It's I think it's more fun to play than it is to living. watch. It looks like we're not going to he was fat. Yeah, he was a big boy. He's a Weinerheimer. There's no reason. Maximilian Ward, how's it going? Thanks for coming by. Let's split up, look for any survivors, and get out of here. Right. One last thing. Here's a radio. Take it. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens. Not at the moment, Kevin, but uh, we'll post it when we are. Right now, we just got to get Moon to finish Echo so he can come back to Vigil. Yeah, definitely Eternal. Definitely does. Fuck. good to have you here to everybody uh 250 people here thank you for coming by hope you guys are enjoying it i'm on my second attempt now i gotta beat 118 was my time i just got i'm gonna try to beat it that definitely wasn't great hey i'm glad you're looking forward to it damien i think you guys are really gonna enjoy it i'm very happy with the way it came out I'm very proud of the team uh the whole production team uh, it was awesome. Beggy was there. I I don't know what it is about lighthouses, but they got something to them. That's why they're always crazy. Lighthouses have always kind of been weird. I know that was slow, but I, I want to see if it's better to just take it a little slow to not get got. Let's get 400 likes. Hell yeah. Thank you, Ian. Whoa. It's on my ass. God damn. I avoided him, but I avoided him in a very slow way. Alright, let's try it again. Did 
going to stop running into walls. All right, let's, uh, let's see if we can get this down. I know that took way longer than I needed to, but it's probably better than getting hit. I'm, I'm, I'm going to learn how many steps, like, exactly to not get hit there. This might be a more cautious uh, playthrough just to make sure that I don't get hit with stupid things. We got plenty of pistol ammo. We'll be fine there for a minute. Thank you, Jerrica. Slickers are fast as hell, yeah. They're like big cats. That's the way I see it. Always oh, fucking around on the ceiling and stuff. Get down. All right, so far, not bad. A little slow with some areas, but I think it's better than getting hit, maybe. Because we save time by not grabbing herbs and then using them. Now, if I don't get hit here, it'll be perfect. Hard to do, though. Might just take him out. Might be, might be better than getting hit. That was bad. Well, that was a boss. That one was tough. That was the alpha zombie. They're all gonna die now because I killed him. I don't think I need to come back through there. Bag, when's the next book reading? Everybody asks. Do it, Bag, do it. I know you're busy as shit with like fucking a million different projects. Read a book, Baggy. Uh, I haven't ran into the tyrant yet. Yeah, probably like a thousand times, dude. Not in this playthrough, but in the previous playthrough, like, half hour ago. Oh, actually, no, I didn't. Uh, I'm not playing B-Scenario. Probably should have put that in the title. Have a good night, Arginus. I love Bioland. It's amazing. It's one of the best things to happen to Resident Evil modding ever. It's so fun. And you have so many crazy mashups with it. It's perfect. And they're continuously uh, working on it and adding to it. Like we get the Resident Evil 1.5 characters coming out with voice acting, like that's amazing. Yeah, the one uh, Bioran team is incredible. Let's play this part well. Let's try to play it as well as we can. It's a little tough here. I'm gonna figure out how I cut back down through the back last time because that did save me a ton of time. I just don't remember what I did. I think I get hit here if I grab this ammo now. We'll see. Let's see. Nope, 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 nope. Good, 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 good. Don't overshoot the door. Hell yeah. No fucking crows. They're a pain in the ass. Because if they hit you, they stun you for, like, a long time. And it's unnecessary. This is another one, too. Like, normally, 90% of the time, I shoot it. Sometimes, I get got by Misty. Shot it? We'll be fine now. We just gotta shoot it on the way back out. I love that the uh, enemies, like, respawn to where they start every time. So, like, you get to... You kind of get, like, a, a second chance every time you go back through a room. I may I actually did make a mistake here. I, I see that now with looking at my inventory. That was stupid. I was supposed to drop off the plug so I can get the shotgun shells. If I can't get the shotgun shells, it's gonna screw me a little bit, so I might have to cut back just a second. Oof. That sucks. Not the end of the world, but 
stupid mistake, not paying attention. Thank you, it man. How they manage that? They just found people that were close, or what maybe sounded like it. Maybe some good actors. I don't know how close it was. I don't think I ever heard the original voice of um, Elsa. I don't know if they did have it. I don't know if it was in the trailers, but they found people that they went with, and I trust them, so should be good. I mean, it's not too far out of the way to have to go back to drop this shit. So it's not like a huge deal, but just something I should have been paying attention to. Yeah, sometimes it's good to run instead of wasting ammo. Yeah, definitely. But sometimes when you can't get through a chunk, it's better to just take that slowly than it is to get hurt and have to go find an herb and blah, 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 blah. Modders are amazing. Honestly, they really are. They're, they're keeping it going. Like, for me, I could just play the vanilla game and be happy. The fact that there's so many cool mods on top of it, like amazing mods, it's just incredible. So many years later, and they're still making amazing mods for this game. Obviously, that tells you, you did something right. You know what I mean? You have a, a great formula. Yeah, definitely, Swolfie. Thank you. Yeah, I agree. It's been, it's been smoother. I'm going to try this. I, I haven't really plotted it out in my head, but I think it might be okay. Yeah, it's definitely going to be fine. Grab that right away when you run it, rather than grabbing it when you run out. Gems in the titties. Grab the key. Grab the plug. Good to go. Perfect. Not perfect, but really good. Nice. Look at that goddamn helicopter there. That's not where you park a helicopter, idiot. Might as well drop this now. I played Stray for a little bit. Yeah, it was pretty fun. Relaxing to play, for sure. Lick her. Gems in the titties. That's where they go. What's wrong with that? Alright, I gotta try to... I'm gonna try to get a little closer now. Last one, I kind of like stopped quite a ways ahead and walked quite a ways further but i'm trying to go a little closer before i stop oh he's there he's there i fucked up it's all right that was the first time you got me not a big deal stop early run faster i'm learning <laughs> why are you breaking legs bag what did you do i missed it Nice, quick turn. For a second there, my brain froze, and I was like, which way? Holy shit, where am I going? That happens too when I, I play Resident Evil 2 Remake. I'll be recording a video. Played it a million times, I know the routes, and then all of a sudden I'll just completely blank. It's all good, Eric. Thanks for coming by, man. Thanks for getting those Mercs badges in the chat. Much appreciated. My beats! Got my fucking toes! Perfect. Except for my toes, that was really good. Purple Marvins, let's go, baby. Get those purple Marvins in the chat. Get a police police officer in like the color purple. Perfect. Give it a second. That time he can't get me. I just have to give it a little bit longer than I normally do, and I can get out of here without him getting me. And now we're gonna go actually go this way, 
which is not the way I went in the last playthrough, but I think it saves time. They want those toesies. Yes, they do. And I, I can grab an herb here if I need to, which I think I actually don't need to. Like, honestly, this, aside from a couple stupid mistakes with the statues and stuff, this is actually going way better than the last playthrough. The lungers in Resident Evil 2 get me every goddamn time. Cove lungers, that's good. That's a good one. Yeah, they do lunge. Yeah, I, I, it's very unfortunate because I feel like now where the channel is, I feel like we could have done a lot of really, really, really cool things with him. And it's unfortunate, but I'm still very grateful that we got to play this game with him. Definitely. And that's a quick way to get around here. Make that fucking crank right now, but I think that's okay. Oh yeah, I think we've all played Res uh, OG Resident Evil 4. That's a that's a fun one. No 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 no. Oh shit. God damn it. Controller disconnected. Can't be doing that, controller. Cannot be doing that. God damn it. There it goes. The run's gone. Fuck, dude. My Bluetooth's fucked up in my computer. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Oh, I should have clicked off of it immediately. Forgot that pauses it. Okay, now we're reconnected. So dumb. Why'd I get a Bluetooth fucking controller? I knew that didn't work. Always had issues with it before. Get out of here, stupid dog. Twice? Are you fucking kidding me? Three times. That's bad. God damn it. That threw me off. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. That really threw me off. Son of a bitch. Add like 15 seconds onto it. Gary with a $5. Thank you for your support once again, Gary. Dude, you've been incredibly supportive tonight, and I greatly appreciate it. Did somebody say herb? Yes. <laughs> Is it that time? Ada Wong. And what, what a babe. Here? What a babe. I'm looking for some guy named Ben. He's one of those some guy. Types. Some random guy. Looking for a scoop. Some nobody. I heard he was locked up in the cell. Holy shit, I didn't expect Ada. Kind of wild, eh? I've you never know what you're going to get in Resident Evil 2. Use DualSense wired. I can try it. It's weird because I used to use my PlayStation 5 controller. I used it for like four or five months, nonstop. I would just connect it and it worked perfect. It was amazing. And then all of a sudden it just stopped working. And I never knew why. I never knew why it started working and I never knew why it stopped working. It's really weird, I know. Like I plugged it in and it just worked and I used it and all of a sudden it stopped working with everything and I have no idea if it was a driver. I have no idea if it was an update. I just have no idea. It worked perfectly for the longest time. I remember in like my streams, I was like, guys, I'm using a DualSense 5 controller. It's amazing. I don't know why I never used it before. I never used it before because it didn't fucking work. And now it still doesn't fucking work. 808. 808. 808 kick drum. 808 clap. 808 snare drum. 808 back. Got to 808 this and I 808 that. 808 boom and I 808 clap. Sorry, I have to say it every time he says 808. It's just, it's a habit. Or we subtract a safe 10 seconds guess. for you the controller BS. Then, right? We could. We could. Now. We could subtract 10 seconds for the controller. I think that'd be fair. What do you want? I'm trying to sleep. But I still here. think I did save a little bit of time. The goal is to beat 118. Is 113 the is the overall goal, but if we can beat 118 ben, in this playthrough, I'll be happy. You told the city officials that you knew something. And I'll be happy if we can hit 400 on, likes. Didn't you? And what are you doing what did you here? Tell them? And who the heck are you? I'm trying 808 Corey, to find 2023. my boyfriend. His name's John. He was working that for was a my joke. of Umbrella Corey took it. based in Chicago, but he suddenly disappeared six months ago. I heard a rumor Time that to see Deep Throw Ben. City. Not yet. Don't worry, it's coming. I don't know anything. 
And even if I did, get those deep throats in the chat. Not yet. Wait, wait for him to get deep throated. Okay, I say we leave him in there. Big old slither and snake down the throat. The splits him in cell? half. God damn, that's wild. Right X X X rated baby. But I'm not about to leave this cell. What an X those like X rated be porn and X X X would be porn and murder. That's what I would feel like. X X X porn and murder. Cause like R is murder and like gore. X is I'm porn, so if you cell. mix R with X, you get XXX. Get out of here before you leave. Like, it right only makes me. sense. Hey, like I'm not horror going porn anywhere. movies. I'm the only cop right. left That's, alive in this. Building. It sounds bad, but when you say what? horror porn movies, it's maybe not Look, as bad. If you want to live, Murder porn? That sounds terrible. <laughs> I had to rephrase. But do you even know how to get out of the city? No, I don't. There's I'm a stupid. kennel in the back of the building. Inside the kennel is a manhole. Go through, and it'll lead you to the sewer entrance. But <laughs> it won't be easy. All right, I'm going. Snuff. Oh, yeah, there's a word for it. Snuff. I forgot. Snuff does sound better than murder porn. Oh, fuck. Row HR is here. God damn it. I can't even talk anymore, guys. I can't be myself. HR is around. I get written up every day in the row chat. At least they're doing their job, right, Baggy? Oh shit! Everything I just said has been has been logged. One day, this is all gonna come crashing down on me when the row files are exposed and row HR leaks everything I've ever said. I've done it to myself. All right, let's not get hit by a fucking spider here. That was stupid last time. Good to see you, Hackmeister. Thanks for coming by. Better late than never. It's all right. You're uh, at the sort of beginning of my second playthrough. So you're good. Now remember, guys, this would have been three playthroughs if it wasn't for the time change. So blame the time change and Tyrant Cheeks for the fact that I'm only going to do two tonight. Ada? It would have never happened if Tyrant didn't bring it up. It never myself, existed yeah. until Tyrant my reminded me that it was time change. I'm with the RPD. Twice in a day. I'm gonna try to break records. It's a dead end. You think we can get upstairs through this shaft? Give me a boost. Down one, I'll baby. Somebody drink me. When can I get an assistant? How many more viewers do I need to get an assistant? <laughs> so I don't have to leave my chair. <laughs> Be real lazy, have somebody massaging my back while I'm playing. God, str streaming's so hard. It's so hard to be on my game at all times. I need somebody to massage me and bring me drinks. Give me a straw. I think uh, Beggy and uh, Andrew wrote something the other day, and I was joking. Uh, they're like, did you read it yet? Did you read it yet? And I was like, oh, can you please? I was Andrew. I was like, can you please just read it to me? I can't, I can't be bothered. And he's like, wow, dude. And I was like, I, I was kind of like channeling my inner Marlon Brando from Apocalypse Now, you know, on set. Completely just never read any of his lines and had people read them to him while he was on set. Yeah, that's goals, baby. Gary Gray with a $10 super chat. Thank you so much, man, for your continued support. One step closer to a row assistant. Did you ever watch King Kong with Jessica Lang when they are on a ship and she says, I was saved by Deep Throat. I do not remember that at all, but yes, I did watch that. I watched the original, I watched the Peter Jackson remake, and I watched the remake remake that took place in the 1970s. I don't remember I was saved by Deathrow. That That is new. That is a fun fact. The dream, right? Max Million Award? Hell yeah. Personal cup holder? <laughs> Hell yeah. Cardboard JJ that sits in the chair. <laughs> I can't even be bothered to play the game, you guys. Ugh, what? You want me to respond to comments? Leon, oh, I can't can even me? read. It's so exhausting. Ada, did you find anything? 
Right here. Hey, I can't reach the ventilation hole. I'm That's right, to Christian. Find another way around. The goat. I'll catch up with you later. Everybody get those goats in the chat for Resident Evil 2. If I don't see a wall of uh, goats for Ada, Resident Evil wait. 2, the greatest game of all time, I'll be a little disappointed, honestly. I'm not going to lie. Look at Leon's kicks. Those things are fancy. Nice kicks, Leon. 808. 808 kick drum. 808 clap. 808 snare drum. 808 back. Got an 808 this and an 808 that. 808. Mm, and a 808. Clap, 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 clap. Guys, what do you think of wearing masks? Shy people like it. They're uncomfortable and I don't like them at all. But the fact that shy people like them, more power to you. Whatever makes you comfortable and feel like you're in your skin and can behave how you want to behave, as long as it doesn't hurt anybody and it's not against the law, go ahead and do it. If you want to wear a mask all the time, even though the COVID thing's over, do it. I think people are at their best when they feel comfortable. There's those goats, hell yeah. Bitch. Hell yeah! Didn't even get close this time. That's what I'm talking about. Thank you. I, I, I feel very happy to see so many goats in the chat. That means that my people, uh, we're getting older, but we're still here, baby. Keeping the classics alive. Okay, bye. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Gotta drop some stuff, though. That's gonna suck. Gotta drop some stuff. That's gonna take a minute out of this. Didn't have to do it last time, but we did go a way longer route last time. Actually, you know what? We did do this. We had to drop stuff earlier, too. So, this is actually not changing anything. G Fuel on the rocks. Hell yeah, brother. That's right, Mr. Lone Wolf. What would you like to drink, sir? A G Fuel. Your finest, purest water mixed with the rocks. Shaken, not stirred. Definitely got to shake G Fuel. If you get that powder, you got to shake it. I, I, I got the steel, uh, steel one, and I fucking shake that like I shake a margarita. And it comes out very, very good. Shake it hard. A lot of ice. I do about a, like almost a full scoop now. I used to do a three, four scoop. Now I do almost a full scoop. And I get some really nice cold water with a lot of ice. And I shake it. And it's the best tasting G Fuel. Can't get lukewarm water. You can't not use ice. I mean, if you don't, if you can't, I mean, you can't. But it's way better with ice. And you gotta, if you fucking stir it, <laughs> you gotta mix that shit. I want raw powder. It's gotta be cracked. I mean, the powder's delicious, and I licked my fingers before after pulling out uh, one of the, the scoops. It's good. I just don't know how much of it I'd eat. I'm not super, like, into real sweet, sweet shit like Cory. Cory would fucking probably eat a scoop of it, just plain. He drinks, like, five or six G-Fuels every time we stream. I can do two or three. Three max. Hey, and I'm fucking wired, dude. He's a different animal. He used to drink, like, fuck. Five, five or six scoops of Tang. I don't I don't even remember. He's, it's some crazy number that I was like, bro, I drank a lot of Tang when I was a kid. But I never drink that much Tang. He's a different animal, that one. Don't ever snort it. Um, absolutely unrelated to me, there was a guy at work that snorted G Fuel and had to go to the hospital because it uh, coagulated in his nose and he couldn't breathe. So G Fuel said, if anybody brings up snorting, do not acknowledge it. Don't talk about it. This is before that happened. Somebody, and it completely unrelated to me. Uh, as I've said before, there's a lot of people at work that were drinking G Fuel before I ever got sponsored. And some idiot <laughs> who thought it was funny, I'm going to snort it. 
snorted it and had to go to the hospital. It's fucking stupid. I, I honestly don't even think it's funny. Like, come on. It's, it's, it's a powder that mixes with water. What do you think it's going to do in your snot? It's not cocaine. Corey would do a lot if dared, but he's also very, like... Something he, uh, uncomfortable with a lot of things. He would do a lot, but he's also uncomfortable with a lot. Probably more than me, though. I'd give him that. There's always that one person. I know, right? That's why we can't have nice things. That's exactly what I think every time somebody says, snort it, snort it. It's like, come on. Use common sense. I get it though, it's a white powder. Cocaine's also a white powder. Both of them get you energized, but one is caffeine that's mixed with water and the other one is a drug that's meant to be absorbed in the bloodstream. <laughs> Well, caffeine's absorbed in the bloodstream too, I guess. G fuel, it's what plants crave. It makes you taller, it makes you more handsome, and it makes people like you more. That's not a fact, I made that up, but it might be true. That's what I say. And if you're a girl, it makes you uh, more pretty, maybe. Probably not though, because I made it up. No, for real though, it uh, definitely, like, when I really, like, I need to wake up. I, I just, I get groggy a lot of the times, you know, like at work or like I'm at the end of the day and I really do not want to go to the gym, but I know I have to. I won't drink the G Fuel right before I go to work or to the gym, but I'll drink it like an hour before I go and it'll be perfect. Uh, it's, it's, I drink it when I like really like, I'll drink it slowly if I need to maintain, but I'll usually drink it pretty fast if I need to wake up fast. It's really good for the energy. Like I said, I never knew about G Fuel. Everybody at work on my shift, when I went to second shift, B shift, they were all drinking and they're like, bro, you gotta, I was like, why is everybody's numbers so fucking good? Like what's going on with the shift? They're like, you ever drink G Fuel? I was like, what's that? They're like, uh, <laughs> fucking gets you going, dude. And I was like, never heard of it. And uh, as, as I started looking into it, I was like, I gotta try this G Fuel. And sure enough, yeah, it, it gets you going. That was that was my first introduction to G Fuel. It wasn't YouTube. It wasn't any of that. It was just people at work getting really good numbers and me wondering what they were doing. Ooh. Sorry to hear about your best friend passing away. Try to smoke rubbing alcohol. Oof. Some people will try anything. Oh, shit. The two scoops... And the one headshot. God damn, this could be dangerous. G Fuel's a hella drug. It's, it's not really that bad, but it does get you going if you need to. It's like coffee, though. Like, you could, if, if you're, you're a coffee drinker, you could substitute uh, G Fuel out with coffee. Um, it's preference, right? Um, I love coffee. I No matter what, I always have my coffee in the morning. But during the midday, midday, I, I don't like, I don't generally like drinking coffee midday or at night if I need to be up. So that's when I have G Fuel. It's, it's like that though. Like if you're into your coffee in the morning to wake you up, G Fuel's like the same thing. It just kicks a little harder sometimes. <laughs> that's why I get the powder. You can choose how much you put in. You don't have to put the full scoop in. I always used to drink three fourths a scoop. Corey always drinks a scoop and a half. You you choose how much caffeine you want and how sweet you want it to be. Oh, there's a G Fuel online store and for your yep, yeah, it's all over, man. Worldwide. I told you, Andy, I'd bring you some, but I don't know if they uh allow powdered capsules on airplanes. I don't know if that would be a thing I could do. Otherwise I'd bring you G Fuel. I think that would probably be pretty frowned upon. Big old tub of powder on a plane. Hey, Gary Gray with another $10 super chat, man. You are definitely number one for support tonight. Thank you so much, Gary. Please, everybody, get those GGs in the chat and get those deep throats in the chat for my boy, 
going down hard after catching that tendril. Thank you, Gary. Too much in excess will give you the shits. Anything in excess will give you the shits, probably. I think that could be said for almost anything. You eat too much vegetables? You're gonna shit. You drink too much water? You're gonna shit. Yeah, that's, that's, I think, yeah. That's, that makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. Ben! All right, Ben Bertolucci. Can you still hear me? Come on, answer. Damn, I don't believe this. All right, I'm gonna grab a drink now story. while there's a cutscene. <laughs> ben. <laughs> Bitter irony. The chief of police, a co-conspirator. Get that scum make him pay hang in there ben oh God. my chest it's burning <laughs> oh no What's taking an wrong? acid bro <laughs> it's just some tums oh i don't know if tums can fix that you got yourself a chest burster yeah a different kind of doctor my friend Good God, what was that? That was Ben dying. No biggie. I would say R.I.P. Ben. You got a cool rat tail, but he's kind of an asshole. And a piece of shit. Fuck him. Where are you going, Ada? To the chemical plant. I have a feeling that's where I'll find John. Don't bend Ada, over. Nice. Hey. Why does nobody listen to me? Ada, wait. Ada, wait. Kick drum. Ada, wait. Clap. Claire. We now have access to the back of the parking like, lot. Every girl that he talks to is like, I don't care. Cool. <laughs> getting out of here and heading <laughs> I feel bad sewer. for Leon in this game. Can you meet me there. I'm on my way. Yeah, you can get this for PC. 100%. Chest dwelling boy. Got a big old burster in his chest. And he's holding himself. I think Leon's about to get a chest burster too. All right, uh, hmm, hmm. Wish I had an herb right now. A little too late though. I think we'll be okay. That one's not supposed to be there that fast. Bart burn. Um, hmm. Fuck. Okay, we'll be okay. We'll be fine. I feel like I'm supposed to have more shotgun shells at this point. I hope that doesn't screw me. I feel like in this playthrough, I might do fantastic and then get screwed over something stupid. I have a feeling. I feel like I also have something in my inventory I don't need. I don't need this stupid fucking key. I uh, honestly, Nicholas, I doubt it, which is very disappointing and sad to say. I don't think we're ever going to see anything for Outbreak. But that's the one I want the most. Look at this penis monster. Two, and then run so these little fucking tadpoles don't get me. Shit. Bad. Bad. Dropped him already. All right. Let's fucking go. I don't know why, but that went, oh fuck, that went stupid well, and then it got screwy when I got blocked by his fucking tail. Get off me. That actually went super well, though. We saved so much time. And I didn't even have to shake that one off. We saved a ton of time there. Like, enough to probably make that screw up with my controller disconnecting. A-okay. 
Mac Mac 93 with a five dollar super chat. Thank you so much, Mac Mac. What's what up from Seattle? Did you grow up watching Dragon Ball like Z? Was what was your favorite stupid. cartoon? I did not, Those man. I I don't know not what Dragon Ball Z was on, but the only thing I had I for kids there, when I was growing up was uh, Nickelodeon. So I grew up on like, Are You Afraid of the look, Dark, Rugrats, Hey Arnold, um, Doug, um, fuck with the football head, the football head kid's name. I love that movie and I, or that show and I can't think of it. The um, Fuck anyways, Nickelodeon shows. Um, so it wasn't until I was older where I found Nick at Night and I found uh, Gargoyles. That was really cool. That was like my step into other kind of cartoons. And then whenever I'd go to my cousin's house in Michigan, uh, they had Cartoon Network. So I got to like kind of experience a little bit more. But Dragon Ball Z and all that, no, I never had that. balls hey gary gray with another ten dollar super chat my man funding my my assistant thank you so much dude i can't wait to get an assistant that'll massage my shoulders when i store him and, and and feed me drinks what's your time at jj don't even remind me it's 352 it's supposed to be 252 i'm supposed to stream till four i'm already at four this is ridiculous i hate time change i gotta stream today don't worry i got g fuel Thank you, Gary. Thank you, Mac Mac. Hey, Arnold. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Leon, I don't know why I was blanking. That woman was... I'm too focused on the game. I can't think about other things. Sometimes when you're really invested in something, you have to shut off all the other parts of your brain so you can only do one thing. So when you ask me questions about my past, I only have one focus, and that's speedrunning Resident Evil 2, baby. Rocco's Modern Life. Oh, I love that show. The Heifer. <laughs> and Rocco. Uh, I gotta watch that show again because it, like, it's one of those shows I remember so fondly, but I don't at the same time. And I feel like as soon as I watched it, it would all come rushing back. All the characters, all of it. Uh, Rocco's Modern Life de definitely deserves a rewatch. The Australian me. kangaroo with and his big old hands. fat friend Heifer. I fat with a B. Ada? Ada Wong. Ada Wong. I've heard that name before. Now I remember. X-Men I played a lot on Super Nintendo. And I do remember watching the show, the cartoon. I watched that a decent amount, but not like a ton. But the the um the game on Super Nintendo was amazing. I always played as uh Dude with the cards, which is weird. Uh, I can't think of his name right now. Because my brain shut off and I'm only focused on speed running because I'm a professional. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But uh the guy with the cards. I don't know. I always played as him with the Super Nintendo game. He's my favorite. Will be joining him shortly. I won't let anyone I'm more of a uh, Cartoon Network fan. Cartoon Network had some absolute big... They did. They definitely did. I just didn't get to watch it all the time. The Real Monsters. Dude, I remember watching Real Monsters. I was super into an episode. And then my parents like turned it off. And I was like, what? why did you turn it off? They're like, we have to go to school. It's, it's time for your... Um, my husband, William. Your... Um, and it's all on parent teacher conference and None i was like I, I screwed some stuff up at school and i was like oh fucking him. no i was like so invested in this show and i know this parent teacher conference is going to be terrible and i like had kid anxiety i remember that i'm going to skip it now we watched it in the first playthrough i already watched it so i can skip it now so we got to move dude it's like four in the, the morning virus. as a result of his virus induced transmutation William should have lost any prior memories he had as a human by now. Gambit, thank you. Even thank you. I know you guys would get me. You guys are my other half of the brain that I can't. I have to turn off all my brains so I can focus on my the fastest world record time of Resident Evil 2. But you guys get me covered with all the other things that I should remember, but I don't. Let me just have another drink. Gary with another $5. Thank you so much, Gary. I, I, I appreciate you, man. Courage the Cowardly Dog. Show I never watched. Too bad. Cartoon Network, kid. We're different. We're not the same. <laughs> That's what I, I used to think, too. Like, uh, these Michigan kids here that watch Cartoon Network. And I watch Nickelodeon. You know, like metal bands now. Like, you see a logo that's, like, all scratchy. And then you see another logo that's super scratchy. And you're like, 
We're not the same. That's how I felt about Cartoon Network and Nickelodeon. We're not the same. Gambit yeah, was cool. Throw cards and shit. Hell yeah, dude. Just threw them hard. Hurt people with them. Spider-Man animated series. Oh, Batman animated series. One of my favorite Batman movies out of all the movies. And there's amazing Batman movies. I think they're all, for the most part, amazing. For whatever style or time they came out. Even the ones that people don't like. As a kid, I fucking loved them. But anyways, I love all the Batman movies. One of my favorite Batman movies ever was The Phantom Menace. Wait. Was that Batman movie? I think. Yep. The Phantom... No. Yeah, Phantom Menace. Why did I... I thought I fused that with Star Wars. Phantom Menace. Yeah, that was a really good one. Amazing. Watched a lot of the Batman cartoon. Don't know how or don't know where. I think I just rented movies. A lot of rented Batman movies. Star Wars is Andrew. How's it going, Andrew? The Star Wars stuff dropped. How is it? Andrew is so pumped for uh, Battlefront Remaster, which I had no idea they were doing that. And I was so pumped to hear they were doing it. I haven't got a chance to play it, and I fucking forgot my crank. There goes all the time that we saved, you guys. All the time we saved. Everything. It's gone. We're going to maybe break 118 if we are super duper pooper lucky. Why don't you guys start asking me questions from my past? This is what happens. I get confused. I will not accept any responsibility. It is all your fault. How dare you? Don't you know I'm speedrunning? Need a beer. Get Andrew a beer. Angry Beavers loved it. Actually, one of my favorites was uh, Kablam. Kablam was awesome. Angry Beavers was great. At a one point in time, Angry Beavers... Of my I think they're all at one point in time my favorite. Here's your beer. Bag you got, Andrew Beer. Good team member. Good job, Bag. Proud of you guys. Working together for once in your lives. Good job. Mask of the Phantasm. What did I call it? Oh, thank you. Mask of the Phantasm. Phantom Menace. It was Star Wars. God damn it. Mask of the Phantasm. I'm sorry. I don't remember, but I knew it was something like that. And I love that movie. At least you can know that I really enjoyed that movie. And I don't remember what it was called, but it was something like that. Phantom Menace. That was fucking Star Wars. God damn it. I knew it. Holy shit. Phantom, yeah, I know now. I knew it. As soon as I said it, I was like, I think I'm saying Star Wars things. Leave me alone. I'm trying to speed run. Bergy Berg, thanks. Beg, beg, Berg. <laughs> Andrew's drunk. God damn it, Andrew. Pull yourself together. Or don't. I don't care what you do. I'm not your mother. <clears throat> Thank you, it man. Appreciate that, man. I think I think that might have screwed me a bit, but I think I'm still gonna finish up 115 to 120. That's the goal. Beat 118, but if I get 120, it's okay. I learned a few things. A few things not to do. I'm gonna try something new here. I've never done before. I have this weird, like, obsessive thing about checking that before the alligator comes here, because I feel like if you don't check it ahead of time, it won't drop. But I don't think you need to. It always takes an extra, like, five seconds. Remember when Batman's girlfriend was a villain in Mask of the Phantasm? That was so cool. See, I didn't need to check it. I just broke my superstition. I 
I also realize. Get your home split. Get those gators in the chat. I also realized in my last stream, I said uh, last week I played Cannibal Corpse. It's a metal band. I played Cannibal Abduction. I say a lot of things wrong all the time. It's like a problem with my brain. It's like I have like young uh, old timers, Alzheimer's. You know what I mean? I feel like I got it already, and I'm only 33. Leon. This I remember you saying that, yeah. I caught it like right after the stream too. I was like, did I say that wrong? And I went back and like clicked on it. I was like, why did I fucking say Cannibal Corpse? I didn't play Cannibal Corpse. I played Cannibal Abduction. Stupid That's idiot. Two, I owe you. Don't mention it. Thank you, Samuel. I just found out. We'll get there. John's dead. One hitter what? quitter. Oh, she's never. She's mind. single. Let's just get out of here. The sooner the better. Hell yeah, let's get out of here. Then they kissed and had babies. It all happened so fast. Leanne doesn't remember it. And when she confronted him 12 years later, he was shocked. They had a kid together. Do you remember that night in Raccoon City? What do you mean do I remember it? I can't get it out of my head. Remember when I told you that John died? And then quickly, you immediately asked if I was single. And then we made love. And then now Leon has a baby. Perfect sequel. To a future Resident Evil. Okay, I'm just kidding. That'd be terrible. Leon Shesh, Ada, 1998. Hey, you didn't know about it, but it happened. It wasn't in the game because that would have given the X rating. I never had, I never ate alligator before. Move your ass, Ada, we gotta move. Go, go. Uh. I love the band Cannibal Corpse. Hell yeah, brother. How about the band uh, Cannibal Abduction? Do you like that band? Fuck, he's not supposed to be over my head this, this soon. Watch it, Hackmeister. It's really good. One of the best Batman movies ever. Look at that fucking poison stuck midair like a ghost. Like a phantasm. Holy shit. Alligator's so good. I, I would try. What's the best way to eat alligator, though? Like, how do you cook it properly to get the best taste out of it? To taste it differently? Because you can cook meat in all different ways. You can make so many different meat taste like other meat. But there's proper ways to eat every meat. What is the proper way to eat alligator? Because I will eat it. One thing I'm a little hesitant about, and I'm very like open to eating different meats, is frog legs. I'm kind of hesitant on that. Gary with another $5 super chat. Thank you so much, Gary. Much appreciated. JJ, did you ever watch the movie Phantasm? That sounds very familiar. Please give me some context because I, I, I don't know. I feel like I have. But I also don't know what that movie is about. Based off the name. Get your finger split. Get your finger split! Oh, I fucking turned on Ada! Did you see that? My auto aim took me right to her face. Holy shit. Phantasma. I want to eat Wallabalub. Is that one of those Star Wars Wookiees? I'd eat a Wookiee. Would you eat a Wookiee? Once you shave all their hair off and cook them up and eat them, I bet they taste pretty good. A Wookiee? Hell yeah. They're actually not bad. Wookiees? That's weird. I was joking. It was a test. Unbelievable. You'd eat a Wookiee? They're so smart. It's fucked up. Fine young cannibals. Got a bunch of fine young cannibals around here. I don't think I want to stick around on this channel any longer. This is going to go south fast. And that's how Ada got her dome split. You're probably wondering how I got here. Well, as Ada's dome just gets split immediately. Hell yeah. Dropped him. See ya. Later, nerd. 
<laughs> got a Metallica t-shirt on. Oh, she got by him? Holy shit. I know, I've heard of my wife ate frog legs. They're good. They're good. They just gotta be made right. I don't believe it. I feel like they're shit. I feel like you're all lying to me. See ya. Damn it, I couldn't get by him. Shit. It helped. Double dome split. Let's go. You didn't do shit. Alright, now you're helping. Holy shit, she shoots fast. Did you hear her going off? Two, 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 two. Guys, we are one. I, I don't mean to push it, but we're one member away from hitting the member goal, which means I'll be gifting out another membership. Just want to remind everybody. Shoot, we are almost out of shotgun shells. That's crazy. Wait, uh, why'd you fucking park your ass right in front of me? I'm trying to speed run, stupid. Frog legs are so nasty. Gary with a $2. Thank you again, Gary. JJ, you're going to have to Google it after stream. All right, I'll check it out. I'll check it out. Sorry, it's hard for me to read. Holy shit, Tony, row team member. We got the whole row fucking team here. Holy shit, I gotta pause. I gotta pause. Holy shit, thank you so much, Tony, for helping me hit the member goal tonight. Hell yes, which is crazy because, you know, usually like Corey says that uh, the mercenaries are traitors to the row squad. The fact that a row team member helped me hit the goal, amazing. Thank you for not thinking we're traitors. Everybody, please welcome row team member Tony and give it up to Tony. Let's welcome our new member and Gary Gray with a gifted. Rose Squad Mercenary Membership. Thank you so much, Gary. Thank you, Gary and Tony. Please give it up to the both of them. Let's welcome our new members. And because of that, I will now gift out another membership. Thank you so much, guys. And please get those uh, custom emojis, those emojis in the chat, because they are way cooler than the Residents of Evil emojis, I promise you. Thanks, guys. And nice to see you, Tony. Hope you're doing well, dude. That brings us up to 27 members. All right, now I gotta play really fast. I gotta think. I need my shotgun here, but I don't need my pistol. Um, but I also am going to get pistol ammo, so I might as well grab it. I'm go I, I don't need all this empty space. So we're gonna grab that, we're gonna grab that. We're gonna grab that, because that's ridiculous that I didn't have that. And we are fine. Even though I'm gonna grab another magazine of Magnum ammo, it's fine. It's fine. Cascade with a $5 super chat. Thank you, Cascade. Hope you're doing well, man. Uh, I woke up to make this donation. God damn, dude. That Now that, that is dedication. I appreciate you more than most because you actually woke up to do that. That's wild. That's hard to do. Hell yeah, brother. Thank you. All right, we're making 120 in this round. I don't think we're beating the last one, but I think we're going to get really close. We're doing so many things better. There's a few things I'm doing worse. But the hype is level 11. Thank you guys for all the hype in the chat. I see that chat moving and it makes me happy. You know I can't read it because I can't be bothered. I'm trying to speed run. I can only focus on one thing. But the fact that you guys are keeping the hype going is much appreciated. I can't be bothered. <laughs> I think that's the funniest thing I ever heard somebody say. I think that actually came from work, where I was asking somebody to do something. And they're like, I'm, I'm so busy, man. I honestly can't be bothered. <laughs> I was like, dude, that's your fucking job. You know, I always thought that was funny ever since then. Like, what a, what a, what a fucking diva. I can't be bothered. Ada, can you hear me? Come on, snap out of it. She died. God damn it. Rest in peace, says Ada. It was nice while we had our time together. And then we made a baby. Are you two for life? Hell yeah, Jacob. That's what I'm talking about. If I ever get a tattoo, dude, I love the row. I really do. But the row wouldn't exi exist if it wasn't for Resident Evil 2. I really want a fucking Resident Evil 2 tattoo with the, the fu not not even the, the logo or anything, just a zombie ripping out of my arm with the hands looking around the corner. That'd be so fucking cool. 
But everybody peer pressures me into getting a row tattoo. They all said, you promised. And I'm like, oh, fuck, I did. A Resident 2 tattoo would be way cooler. You know it. You all know it. Get over here, you big bitch. Fucking blasted my ass into another cam camera scene. The shotgun's awesome. Get your dick blasted! One more, one more! Yes! No! You broke your own animation, you piece of shit! I've never seen that before. God damn it. Get dead. Hell yeah, let's go. Willy B clapped his cheeks, let's go. Ruin JJ first evil for life. Hell yeah, brother, thank you. You know what I realized tonight? And it would have been super wordy, super wordy, but I wanted to tie JJ versus evil in with the residents of evil, right? This used to be called JJ True Gaming. That's what it always was. And uh, I switched it because Don't I liked the Evil me, Dead Ada. theme. Come on. And then I liked Ash vs. Evil Dead theme. That made a lot of sense. Come on. Uh, Tucker and Dale vs. Evil. The vs. Evil, I liked it. And I was like, Residents of Evil. JJ vs. Evil. That's cool. But then I was like thinking today, and I was like, if I wanted to tie it in with a row, and I wanted to go really hard on the Resident Evil 1 theme, shouldn't I have called it JJ vs. The Residents of Evil? And then there was a part of me that thought that would have been way too wordy and terrible. But at the same time, I was like, oh, that would have been really cool. <laughs> Why didn't I do that? Welcome back. And then it would have made more hey, sense when I said, hell yeah, merch the real MVPs, lab. overthrow the row. That would have made way more room. sense. So just rest here in the the residents of evil. I, I'm, I'm combating oh, the, the home down. of evil Enjoy on this yourself. channel. C come on. Go. It's a no-brainer. I fucked yourself. up. I told you. It's my job to look after you. But hey, knock it off. We're not the merc jerks. With me. We don't jerk each other I've off and we're not assholes. A short period of time. So it's I only horror games? They get so stale I, and boring. I well, know. Mr. Unpopular I'm Opinion. You get a really unpopular anyone. opinion, dude. Uh, no, I, I, I mean, very you. rarely do we're I play something that's not horror. Together. But every time I do, it's Wait boring. I'll be right back. Uh, so maybe... It, this might not be the channel for you, dude. I don't know what else to say. I want that hoodie. Thank you. It's uh, not available anymore. But you can get a Rose Squad version of this hoodie, which is really cool, too. Promise. Hold on to that. I love this music, so good. Oh my God, speaking of tattoos, the color filling on my back tattoo hurts so much. Yeah, Beggy, that tattoo looks sick. I don't think I ever told you that. It looks good. It's not a row tattoo. Oh, I did tell you that. I said, it's not a row tattoo bag. It's our, I said weird looking row tattoo, but it is a cool tattoo. Mercs of evil. Well, we're not of evil. We're not evil here. We're fighting evil, God damn it. How many times do I gotta explain this? I'm just kidding. Reverses it. We don't like the evil. We're trying to combat it. The residence of evil fuels the evil. Or is here we're trying to fight it, you know? It's a thing. It's a thing. It's not a big deal at all, and I make it a huge deal. What'd I say? JJ, don't take the AIDS break, because you're gonna get one, and guess what I did? I took the AIDS break. Son of a bitch. Yeah, Tony's kind of evil. He he kind of is. I think, I think um, he's from Boston, so like there's a part of him that's got a little evil in him. I'm just kidding. Oh, you even said it. I'm from Boston. Now I'm pretty evil. I'm from, okay, so I don't feel as bad now saying it. Uh, there's a few times I could have shaved off time, and I didn't. But I'll learn. It'll get ingrained somehow, some way. Maybe in next year. I don't know. When it's too late. Life is our business. Life uh, is... Our, our business is life itself. I think that's the umbrella motto. Our business is life itself. I don't know if I ever heard the motto that you're saying, though. I think that's not the motto. I think you made that motto up. I 
Remember the motto, obedience breeds discipline. Discipline breeds unity. Unity breeds power. Power is light. That's my favorite motto. I try to think about that every day when I'm going on a power trip. Son of a bitch. And all Bostonians are evil, Tony. See that fuck up? That was a big fuck up. That's what's gonna keep us from getting under our 18. I think out of all the row team though, out of everybody that has tattoos, which is like two people, I think Bob has the coolest tattoo. He's got an actual ROE tattoo and it looks sick. They both died, nice. Collapse the salad. It's dead now. There was a salad here. It's gone. I have no tattoos. I'm just too picky. I would, I would get a tattoo. I'd like it for a day, and I'd, then I'd hate it, and I'd regret it every day. And every day when I'm just going on with my everyday life, I would think about that tattoo that I hate, and it would drive me crazy. And my good day would go to a bad day, all because of that tattoo. Look at Plan 69. That's how I am. I know I'm not the type of person to have tattoos. I'm very art artistic. I like art. I love it. But I'm so picky. I am so fucking picky. And I'm obsessive over things. And a tattoo that I didn't like would drive me insane. I wouldn't be able to focus. Holy shit, what the fuck, dude? You dead? Oh my god. What's going on with these fuckers? Bostonians are awesome. Tony's the Bostonian. I don't want that. I thought I needed that. I don't need that. Unicorn, I'll never get a tattoo. I will. I will, definitely. I promise everybody I would. I just don't know if I want to get a row one or a Resident Evil 2 one. And if I get a Resident Evil 2 one and people are upset, I might still be happy. I don't know. It'd be cool. Hackmeister with a $2 super chat. Thank you for your support. JG, just name it Roe vs. Evil. Chat, what do you think? Yeah, what do you think? I always thought Residents of Evil 2, but then we made a Residents of Evil 2. Because then it would have been all Resident Evil 2, and I would have just streamed a lot of Resident Evil 2, and that would have been cool. And I think what the team did with Resident Evil, Residents of Evil 2 is still cool. Um... <laughs> then I thought GG vs. Evil and do an Evil Dead theme. And that's pretty cool too. GG vs. the Residents of Evil. And then I take the role of the shotgun guy from the first cover art from Resident Evil 1. And that'd be super cool. Tony with a $5 super chat. Thank you, Tony, for your support. I appreciate you. I don't care what Beggy says about you when you're not around. I like you. Uh, he says, well, so we take a cheese grater to the tattoo. Uh, so we take a cheese grater to the tattoo when you don't like it anymore bob and baggy will hold you down i work the gator you know you can remove tattoos way easier than a grater you fucking savage <laughs> jesus christ i wouldn't like it after two days hmm. Hmm. Might be able to skip a lot here if I do this. Actually, you know what? I can skip even more. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, yeah, yeah, yeah. I could probably skip this whole chunk that I usually do. This would shave a ton of time. And if I don't grab three aid sprays and I only grab two, and then I keep my shotgun for the few plants that are coming up, and I just grab the few things that are in that room and I go right to the boss battle instead of going back to a save room, that actually might save me a ton of time. And if I run past this one, because he's used, like not worth my time, definitely. He fucking jumped into a wall. I got a piece so bad, it's ridiculous. You don't even know. It's it's holding me back. 260 people here and almost 400 likes. Hell yeah, guys. Thank you so much for that. I, I greatly appreciate that. Glad you guys are enjoying this. It's It was a good bonus stream. I'm glad I did it. And uh, you guys have been here like the majority of this whole time and... I've been enjoying it and I appreciate that. Thank you. 
There's a plant here. He's gone now. Not yet. Shit. Had to do it. Didn't want to get pissed on. Nice. That was good. That was good. All right, I gotta pee really bad. I'm gonna, oh, no, you know what? I'm gonna do this. Then I'm gonna pee when the cutscene's going. Then I don't have to worry about any time racking up unintentionally. Cheese grater plan, guys. You guys are, we are making, we're making a salad. Getting healthy. Hell yeah, brother. Only five more to 400. Let's destroy it and hit 420. Thank you, Samuel. That'd be cool. I'll get the, get the herbs in the chat if we hit 420. If we don't, well, don't get any herbs in the chat. Get your dome split. Get your whole fucking body split, bitch. That was sick. I don't use a shotgun for the boss battles. This actually makes sense. Get your fucking body split. I was trying to group you guys. Uh, Boom! What? Boom! One more. One more. No, we're out. All right, I can get around him. He's a slow piece of shit. Oh fuck, he got me. Damn it! Fall on the ground. Die. Oh, I gotta pee so bad. All right, we got it. I can only grab the magnum ammo. Oh, actually, I can grab both. Perfect. That worked out. And so, see, that's one of those things I should have been planning from the beginning. That saved a ton of time. I don't know if it's going to help at all, but it, it'll help a little bit. All right, pee time. You Let's get those Annettes in the chat. You I don't know murdered what that my husband. I know what you're looking for. You came for the G virus, didn't you? from me. This is my husband's legacy. Now, where's that spy you were working with earlier? You know who I'm talking about. What? You really don't know anything, do you? <laughs> You're so gullible. She's one of the operatives sent here by the agency. The only reason why she came here is to obtain the G-Virus. That's a lie. No, it's the truth. I discovered this when I did a background check on her. She specifically got close to John and became his girlfriend to get information about Umbrella. That can't be. I know her. Ada wouldn't do something like that. If you don't want to believe it, I don't really care. You're about to die anyway. What happened? Shit! Oh, that was probably the longest pee of my life. Holy the crap! I almost didn't make it. Has been Ooh, that was a close one. The self-destruct sequence has been activated. Thanks, Ian. This Appreciate that. I'm okay. At best. All employees proceed to the emergency car at the bottom platform. We had 400 likes. Hell yeah, guys! Thank you. What? Oh, oh no! Oh no! Oh no! 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 All right, shave another 10 seconds off. Controller's reconnecting. What happened? Why does that do that? I was trying so hard. All right, we're back in business. I figured I'll click off the game and it'll connect way faster. Leon. Oh shit, Ada. Annette got I've Mr. and Mrs. Y from Streets of Rage for energy. What are you that was doing? a good game. You know what this is about. Hurry! So just I did. hand over the G. Hurry! Bus. Sheva! Hurry! I don't believe I want to play Resident Evil 5 again. You know, we Corey and I about everything. We played like That's the first I told you to leave without me. A, you the listen. first third of Resident Evil 5 handed over. without don't the uh shoot you. the filters. You with with uh, removing the filters, uh, ray tracing. It was a ton of fun. And it got like 100,000 views. It was a stream that got like 100,000 views. Oh. And we didn't continue it. I don't oh. get why. Like, we were having Ada. fun. And like, I, I thought about it and I was like, oh my Ada. God, I completely forgot I we were going to like continue that. We don't never did. Just like uh, the other day, somebody commented on one of my videos and they're like, are you ever going to finish Resident Evil 4 VR? Uh, and I was like, holy shit. We didn't finish that, dude. I don't intentionally not finish Shut videos. Up. I forget. Or it. another series comes up. I, I don't mean to do it. I forget sometimes. Both know it. No. I By the way, this seems uh, sad escape. and stuff. You just have to help me out here. I, I just like the extended cut when she really pings off every pipe on her way down to the bottom. Escape from everything. Goodbye. 
game is a masterpiece. And, uh... Ada! I don't think any game has ever been this good ever since. This is, uh... I guess you'd say this is the peak of gaming. In my opinion. If you're looking at gaming through my eyes, this is the pinnacle. I reached it when I was eight years old. Nothing will ever be the same. There's good games. There's amazing games. There's masterpieces, but not on the same level of Resident Evil 2. So, this Who agrees with me? Done. Hit one if you agree that Resident Evil 2 is a masterpiece, the pinnacle of gaming. Hit two if you don't agree. And mods, get ready for twos. Because we're going to have to get some bands going, baby. <laughs> Choose wisely. Fuck, that was bad. I'll be okay. Not dead. Holy shit. I wasn't, I was, I was not paying attention. Bye bye. Wrong button. Alright, pay attention, JJ. That cannot happen again. She'll be fine. Alright. There's some smart people in the chat that understand. Okay, that'll be good. That'll be good. There are some naked zombies, though. I might need to use my. Fuck. Holy shit, I have so many. So many! like-minded people here in the chat there's a few of you like uh unpopular opinion who are living up to their name that i didn't want to do that might have might have a small problem guys might uh oh fuck i got a big problem big problem we are definitely not beating this in 118 but we're gonna beat it in 125 Fuck. I missed somehow, some way. I missed a magazine or two of Magnum rounds. I don't remember. I was only half paying attention. And uh, because of that, now I need to bring my shotgun shells. Because we're not going to have enough Magnum ammo to defeat the boss. So it's kind of good that we had our shotgun, but we inevitably did have to come back here, which does suck. But at the same time, we always come back here, so we didn't ruin it. Like, we didn't add any time. We just kind of made it more complicated for the closure of this. Uh, we didn't shave any time off that I wanted to. That was unfortunate. And if somehow, miraculously, I beat this in un under an hour and 18, I'll do a, I'll do a flip in real life because... Uh, I think it's impossible at this point. It was a good run. It was a good run. It's not one of my proudest, and it's definitely better than the hour and 30. But it's it's slop. And I will, I will contribute that 100% to the fact that I started having a few drinks. Yep. So I've learned something. Actually, this was a test. It was a test to see if I could have a few drinks and relax and have a good time and still get a good time. And guess what? I can't. I got to be on my toes 24-7, baby. It's impossible. Hell yeah, we're, we're, we're practicing, right? We're learning. We understand now. You can't have a few drinks and get a good time. It's impossible. I learned. I am better now. I promise. Five. Nice. That was good. That was good. There's like so much in this playthrough that is way better than my last playthrough. And there's so much where it's like, dude, pay attention. Stop doing dumb shit. At least I'm self-aware. got me I don't take chances when I got three fucking come on four more shit jumped on my fucking head dude he did a barrel roll off my head that was wild oh let's fucking go dude holy shit what happened I get good at this boss battle I don't know how but it happened I might actually be okay that was pretty fucking fast dude Holy shit. Yeah, we all fucking... I think that's what threw my speedrun off. Honestly, how did he fucking go back up on the ceiling? Why is... Why did he go from... Why is he up there? I've never seen that before. He always dies where he dies. Did I... 
He was on the ground when I killed him. That was weird. Anyways, I think what threw off my speedrun was the time change. I think it fucked up my whole life, and I hate it. That was good, though. That was, that was, I'm very happy with that. That was good. I don't know, man. Um, they could either be good and, like, just shave 118, like, at 117, or it could be a little wild and be, like, 125. I don't know. It's either way at this point. I really don't know. Uh, once I started having drinks, my, my time perception kind, kind of got lost. But, like, there was a lot in that that was, like, pretty fucking good. I just know that going forward, if I want to actually practice and get good at this, I cannot have a few drinks. But the first playthrough went really well. Like, I wanted, I thought 125 and I got 118. That's good. That's close to my best time. So, figured second run would just be kind of casual you know have to find my it went pretty well i don't know what do you guys think everybody this right now i want to know what do you think my time is for the second run in the chat the closest person to get it i'll give you a big old high five and if i miss the closest person to say it remind me now while the credits are going i'm gonna have one last final nightcap even though it's 4.30 in the morning and it's only technically supposed to be 3.30, which means I should have a half an hour, but now I'm a half an hour over my time. God damn it. At least it's Sunday tomorrow. I guess the right time last time. Did you, Jerrica? Good job. 126, 114. Holy shit, if I got 114, dude, if I beat 113, I'd die. I'd literally die. Like, it was so slop, but that's my best time. 121? Okay. 120s. I'm seeing a lot of 120s, like, kind of in that range. 119? I mean, I'd be okay with 119, you know? I still get weird when I'm streaming it and playing. I play better off stream because you guys don't stare at me, but you keep staring at me. I, I can't play when you're watching. Gary! Thank you so much for that $5, Gary. JJ, look up the band Collide Song. It's White Rabbit. The video is Resident Evil Arms. That changed color is the best tattoo. What? Lights on. I'll check it out. Thank you, Gary. Once again, massive, massive thank you to Gary for all his support. Let me grab one more drink. I'll be right back, guys. Let's keep it. I'll skip it. I just need a second. All right, guys. Moment of truth. Here we go. What is it going to be? Ooh. Uh, maybe like 121, maybe 122. If it's over, that'll be kind of a little surprise. It was kind of sloppy, though. My controller disconnected twice, so I get like 20 seconds. 120. That's fair. That, that, that seems fair. I did so much better, but there's a few times where I was like, come on, that was stupid. Not bad, though. Both games, 118, 120. Not terrible. Just not... Not better. Not better. Hmm. You know what, actually, I could probably do? Is I could play this on my own and just record it and then upload my best time. That might be cool. Except you'd watch it and I would literally not say a single word the entire time because I'd be laser-focused. All right, so tonight... We definitely made progress. Uh, we progressed by adding another five fucking minutes onto my fastest playtime. God damn it. You guys were supposed to help me. What is a world record? Like 45 minutes or 46 minutes? I don't know. I'm just trying to get under an hour. That's my goal. Gotta do it really fast, too. I only got a few months, guys. I really need some coaches. The controller disconnecting messed me up. Time changing actually kind of did mess me up because now I look at the time and I get anxiety. Um, what else? Um, there's a few things that really threw me off. But honestly, at the end of the day, I got a little lax at the end of the first playthrough and I had a few drinks and that really made me do some stupid things. But there was other times like I fucking flew by areas like super fast that I didn't do the first time. Uh, you know, it's just, it's. I think what it is, I just got to get in my element play this game enough to where I remember it, where I can like literally go on autopilot. That's how I play the Resident Evil 2 remake. When I play that game, 
I'm auto, I'm autopilot. Like I can pl I played that so many times. I've recorded so many videos on that game that I can literally play it talking to the chat the entire time and I'll still get a decent time. That's how I got to get this game. And I play this game probably more than I played the Resident Evil 2 remake. Well, not probably. I played it way more. I just don't play it as like back to back to back to back. When um Resident Evil 2 remake came out like a few few months or maybe a year after when the mod videos were like doing stupid well, stupid well, I made it a habit to play that game like every day so I could record these videos and know what I'm doing and play them well. And uh, I think that repetition of doing it, like there's so many times I play the game I never streamed. I think that helped me like really understand like don't move this way, move that way. Don't do it this way, do it that way. I still make mistakes, but like it was a lot of practice that uh, that was just into the mod videos, you know what I mean? Would you want to see Resident Evil 2, 3 remake remaster in the style of Resident Evil 1 remake? 110%, uh, I would, uh, I would, I would I would actually, as much as I love the Resident Evil 2 remake, I'd give it up. I'd give up 2 and 3 for 2 and 3 to be done like Resident Evil 1 remake. I've, I've talked about this many times before, but like the reason why I wanted a 2 remake is because of Resident Evil 1 remake. That's what I wanted. I'm happy with what we got. I'm very, very grateful. I love that game. I owe a lot to that game. There, this channel is where it's at because of that game. That game did super well, uh, but I would still give it up for one, uh, a two remake in the style of one, definitely. Super fun hunk run. Oh my god, I'm not doing four survivor tonight. I can do four survivor. I beat it, but I cannot do tofu survivor. I can't do it. I've never beat that before. When I get to that, uh, the hallway with the arms, but they have the uh, plants. I can't get past it. I. I think I did a stream before playing it, and um, my god, it was a nightmare. Let's go back to the the just chatting, though, so we can close this out. I'm not going to end it right now, but I'd rather be doing this conversation there. Yeah, so that was fun. That was fun. Um, like I said, uh, I'm probably going to be doing more of these just bonus Resident Evil. It's going to be the same thing. It's going to be Resident Evil 2, Seamless HD Project. It's going to be Leon A scenario. I have to practice. I got a big thing coming up. I cannot wait to tell you guys what I'm doing. But uh, right now, it's 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 confirmed. It's just got to be approved. So um, it's very exciting. It's it's one of the biggest things that I've, I've, I've done. One of the biggest things that I've had. I'm super excited. But I'll tell you guys as soon as I'm able to. Uh, but I... I gotta practice this game and when when you say hey you have to do this um and you need to get good at it and it's my favorite game of all time well god damn you don't have to twist my arm you know what i mean so i'm probably going to be doing more practices bonus streams they're not going to take the place of the main streams jj versus evil is always going to be something relevant something interesting that i like or an indie horror game uh next friday i have rotten flesh planned it's a cosmic horror survival horror game looks super cool very retro uh so the fridays are always gonna be the same but i may be going live here more randomly for resident evil 2 practice run so hopefully you guys enjoyed it i mean it looks like you did we hit over 400 likes which is absolutely incredible uh this channel is way smaller than than the residents of evil so 400 is a very tough number to hit here so that tells me you guys liked it, which makes me happy. Thank you. Uh, you and your secrets. It's not It's not that I want to be secretive. It's just that they told me I couldn't say it yet. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I can't, I can't help that. But it's going to be cool. It's going to be really cool. Love the stream, JJ. Glad it was up early enough to catch it. Yeah, I'm glad you were up early enough too, man. Good to have you here, Link. Oh, Jerrica, practice. You want to talk about practice. I need a coach. And then I need the whole row team to be here as coaches. Yeah, help me out, guys. Actually, you're all my coaches. Get my corner. Um, RE2 Remake has a classic camera angle mod that's recently came out on the next. So I know that Resident Evil 2 Remake has the free cam that lets you pick the camera angles, but you can't save it. So you're telling me Resident Evil 2 Remake got a fucking mod that lets you play the game and fix camera angle? Holy shit! That's probably gonna be the most exciting mod i've ever played oh my god i gotta look that up are you serious and how have i not seen this yet what the hell fixed camera is my favorite uh nexus hold on let me see let me see how legit this is i believe you it's just like i'm kind of shocked because i didn't think the 
trainer let you save presets. Holy fuck. Holy fuck, you're right. There is a mod here. Oh my god. Alright guys, I'm canceling the roast stream tomorrow so I can make a video on this. I'm just kidding, but holy shit. There is a mod here. I don't know how well it works, but I'm very, very, very excited. Oh my god. Usually these videos, like, somehow, some way, they pop up before I can even learn about them. I've not seen anything on this. And YouTube knows I like this shit. This is the kind of stuff I click on. What the fuck? Hackmeister! Holy shit, with a $10 super chat. Thank you so much, Hackmeister, for your very generous support. JJ, do you have multiple BTs connected? This happens to me all the time when I have to reconnect my mouse headset while I play. I try to go wired, to be honest. So, I don't. Actually, I actually had a wireless keyboard that I loved. I paid a lot of money for it. It's my favorite keyboard. I stopped using it because of my Bluetooth. My mouse? Wireless. Now, it's wired. I, everything is wired. The only thing that is wireless is my controller. And when I bought this controller, it said it could be played with batteries or connected. So I was like, okay, cool, because I can't go wireless. It just won't work. But I, f I didn't realize that when you buy a wireless controller, if you plug it in, it won't die, but it's still Bluetooth. And uh, I screwed up. And that's why we we're using my daughter's controller for so long, because that doesn't have batteries. That can only be played plugged in. I should have bought another one of those. That would have saved that. And I still might go out and buy another just wired. Her controller was like 25, 30 bucks. And that thing has never once had an issue. It's always worked. I plug it in, it works. My, for some reason, my computer, this very expensive computer that I put so much time into building and rebuilding and rebuilding to build up to be a content computer, uh, at the time, super fucking ahead of its time, cannot do Bluetooth, and it blows my mind. My laptop, I connect it immediately. No problem. It's weird. I don't know. Something's wrong with the Bluetooth in this. I'm too stupid to understand what. Uh, Adazukin, thank you for that 150 and those sweet golden cheeks. Everybody clap them. Thank you, Adazukin. I, I appreciate that greatly. Oh, I'm excited for this RE2R classic fixed camera mod. I, I know there's videos out. I know you can do it with free cam. I didn't know they, that it would be able to save. That's crazy. Uh, I just, it might be kind of complicated to play. Hopefully it's like Resident Evil 5 with the fixed cam. It's tough, but you could still make it work. Hopefully it's like that. Or maybe if they added, oh god, that would be impossible. But if they could add like a uh, auto aim. Oh, I feel like something like this would probably need an auto aim. But aim broke, don't fix it. God damn right. Uh, Alright guys, it's been fun. Honestly, I'd sit here and chat with you guys for another 15 minutes. But because it's almost 5 a.m., because of fucking time change. Hey, get one in the chat for fuck time change. Get two in the chat if you like time change. But anyways, fuck time change. Because of that, I gotta go to bed now. Uh, I want to make sure I get enough sleep and can get up early enough to get stuff done for the stream tomorrow. But remember, we're going to be live, well, not tomorrow, today on the Residents of Evil, continuing Deep Fear. That's going to be exciting. I I'm, I'm enjoying that game. It's good. Once we figure out how to fucking pull our gun out, that was a controller issue, uh, it's really good. So if you like, like, classic style survival horror games, uh, actually on the Sega Saturn, uh, check out the Residents of Evil tomorrow, or today. Uh, for that we're gonna be continuing that and then I'll probably be covering this Resident Evil 2 remake classic fixed camera mod But I also am gonna be covering the Resident Evil 2 third person retro style by um, oh, Fuck what's his name? God damn it. I'm gonna be covering that everybody was talking about it at the beginning of the stream I seen it. It was amazing. He said I could share his video uh, Let me just check cuz I don't want to screw up his name rustic games yeah, he's amazing. I've covered a few of his videos before. Uh, and then I'll also have that other game everybody's telling me to play that I just downloaded tonight. It looked cool. I wanted to play it like two weeks ago, but then we had so many things happen. The Killing Antidote. So we got three videos I'm working on, guys. There's going to be a lot of shit coming out. Uh, but uh, other than that, I'll be live next Friday here. Friday night, Saturday morning with uh, Rotten Flesh. A cosmic survival horror game. Tons of shit. There's so many games. I love it. I love it when there's so much I can't do it all, but a lot of cool stuff coming up. So you guys have a fantastic night. I'll see you in some hours, you know, 
uh, like later today. Uh, other than that, if I don't, so you have a, a good week, and I'll catch you back here on JJ vs. Evil. If not, I'll catch you on the Residents of Evil. If not, maybe I'll see you over on the road Twitch uh, with Baggy and Tony. But uh, thank you for all hanging out. Thank you, a massive thank you for helping me demolish my light goal, and a massive thank you for helping me uh, hit my member goal. Appreciate it, guys. Mercs, let's go. Have a good night, and I'll catch you in the next one, guys. Bye. Damn it, Gary, I can always count on you to come in swinging, even at the very end of a stream. Thank you so much, Gary, for that very generous $10 super chat. Much appreciated. The cherry on top. See you and Corey later today. Hell yeah, brother. See you later today. Have a good night, Gary and everybody. See you soon.